All right. What's up, guys? Hang on just one second. Got to make sure that my game comes up. And kaboom. There it is. Check it out. All right. Let me alt tab out so I have you guys on screen. What's up, guys? What? You guys are already mad at me? Come on, man. I haven't even done anything yet. Laser must be Canadian. Uh, it's always snowing. Uh, I'm from Wisconsin. Just honorary Canadian. Uh, I'm like a Canadian, but I, sp I spell shit right. <clears throat> uh, the ice, thanks for the 10 months, dude. Welcome back. I appreciate the double digit support. Thank you very much. Yeah. I wasn't here for the end of the stream, so I'm just getting mad now. <laughs> He's already cheating. I don't expect anything else at this point. Come on, man. All right. Uh, more Slay the Spire today. That's right. Um, how are you guys feeling? Happy Tuesday. Um, so the plan today, guys, is that we are going to play more Slay the Spire. Uh, maybe we'll get through more than one run today. Um, I guess it probably depends on if I die or not. Because I'm still not confident at the game and I have to read everything really thoroughly. So uh, I probably will still be really slow, especially since we're going to be playing a new character today. So I don't even know if anything that I learned yesterday is going to uh, apply to today. However, um, I think that we're going to try to play like three or four hours to slay the spire and then we are going to get into uh, Mega Man Zero Two for the first time ever. So that should be a good old time. You guys are looking forward to that. I know I am. Wait, there are multiple characters? Wow, we. Yeah, yesterday we unlocked a character named the Silent. Chat was calling them the Silent but Deadly. So I guess there's that. <laughs> You're getting your second dose in 10 minutes? Congratulations. I get mine on the 27th. 27th. So, 17 days. Oh, what's up, Crasher? How's it going? You're feeling pretty ugh, but you got two days off. Nice. That's good at least. That's nice. Oh, let's see. Let's see. The hell was I just thinking? I'll stream for you on the 27th. No, the 27th is a Friday, so um that that might be actually my last Friday off. Um I think that that's going to be my last Friday off, and then after that, I'm going to start taking Sundays off. So, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking that the 27th is going to be the last time that I take Friday as my day off. And then going forward, we're going to, uh, given Sunday to Vixen, there you go. End of an era. Yeah, um... Also, if you guys didn't hear what the plan for this coming Saturday is, uh, Tofu and I are going to be playing Risk of Rain 2 together uh, for the first time ever. Sundays were FF9, right? Yeah, they were, but you, you, know, you know what happened with that. Um, I, I have a question, actually. So, any of you guys who are familiar with Risk of Rain 2, is it playable with controller? I haven't even bought it yet. Um, I don't even know. I don't even know how to play it. Yes, it is. Thank God. <laughs> I hate playing with mouse and keyboard. <laughs> good. Good, good, good. All right. Zero Two makes a lot of improvements, I think. Good, good. Uh, I mean, I had fun yesterday still. I had fun yesterday with Zero One, but... Um, I, I think that the, the structure of the game was really weird uh, with, like, the whole do missions at the same areas over and over again is a little bit weird. You prefer mouse and keyboard controls? Yeah, I, I don't. <laughs> I just don't. Not for me. Also, it's just easier to stream when I'm using a controller. I can, like, lean back just a little bit. <sighs> Relax a bit. I feel so tense using mouse and keyboard. Yeah, I liked Zero One, but yeah, it's a little bit odd. A little bit of an oddball game. <laughs> Um, okay, what is in the news? What's in the news? If I recall correctly, you play Gunja with a controller? Yeah, I play everything with a controller that I can. Um, I even tried playing Loop Hero with a controller the first time that I played it, and then I was like, this is terrible. Oh, I can just play with the mouse and nothing else? All right, we'll do that. <laughs> so, yeah, I try to play everything that I can with a controller. I just prefer it. 
There's a ton of quality of life mods for Risk of Rain 2 if you decide that you want to change something. That's cool. Uh, I mean, Tovu and I are just going to play vanilla. We've never played it before. In, in fact, we've barely even seen it before. We've both... Our, both of our experiences with Risk of Rain 2 is chat recommending it to us and watching a little bit of Patty. And with Patty, you're not necessarily paying as much attention to the gameplay as you are to his banter. Because uh, that's kind of what he's about. So, yeah, I don't think that we learned very much from watching Patty play it. So you have no experience. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> How's it going, uh, Chow Boo? Definitely fun with Multi and the other person also new. Yeah, I think that we'll both catch on pretty fast. I think we'll both catch on fast. I'm not anywhere near as good at, like, 3D games as I am at 2D platforming games. So I don't expect it to be a game that I excel at, but I usually catch on to stuff fairly quick. We both beat Returnal, right? So we must be at least somewhat competent at the whole uh, third-person shooter shit. Yeah. What time are we doing that? Uh, when I start stream, um, Tofu is going to switch over to it, and we're both going to start it. Maybe do Risk of Rain 1 then too? Yeah, that one's a 2D platformer, right? I might at some point, but the reason we're doing Risk of Rain 2 is because we were both interested in it, and I'm particularly interested in it because it's in the pyramid, so. We're talking about Risk of Rain 2. Risk of Rain 2. Mmm. Did you guys see that crazy ass lady who was licking everything in the grocery store the other day? What's up, Royal Servant? Oh, God. <laughs> yes, I did. Uh, is Mello here? I'm still waiting for him to send me his video game since he quit forever. <laughs> yeah, so, so it was this lady who was, um, I, I believe that she is anti-vax and she was upset about this store's mask policy. So in order to stick it to the libs, she started licking everything and recording video of it and putting it up online. And, um, yeah, yeah, <laughs> people are so weird, oh my god, yeah, I agree, I agree, you got a haircut today, nice, nice, hmm, I still don't need to get a haircut for a little while. I got one right at the beginning of July, so it's only been just over... It's only been five weeks. So, yeah. I usually get a haircut after about two months if I'm just on, like, a regular haircut schedule. Sometimes I wait a little bit longer, but, yeah. I don't have to get one for a little while. I do like getting my haircut now. I used to hate it. I used to fucking hate getting my haircut because, like, I was, I was rocking the really long hair, so... Licking everything you say. Honestly, I'm really surprised how much use the Mrs. Incredible emote has been getting. The, that emote is honestly one of the like most used ones. And I guess I, maybe I shouldn't be terribly surprised when I had Mrs. Incredible's ass that was like my most used emote. <laughs> Oh man, this is my, my most used emote by a long shot outside of people spamming laser corn dilly. <laughs> the rump is better than the face, but we'll take either. Yeah. Yeah. Cornery. <laughs> oh man. Um I uh I saw a video today right before I started that I thought was a really interesting topic of conversation. So the video was what is the worst thing that you can think of that is legal? What is the worst thing that is legal?
TikTok? TikTok is the worst thing that's legal, huh? <laughs> Mukbang. <laughs> you can pick up another person's dog poop barehanded. You guys are listening to some fucking dumb shit. <laughs> See, these, these are all things that are really stupid. <laughs> Yeah, I mean that varies from country to country, I guess. I, I I guess that when when I think of things that are legal, I guess I'm thinking like in in my country. Um durian. <laughs> I've never even seen durian in real life. Going to jail for not paying fines, at fucking debtors prisons. Yeah, yeah, one of them was uh for profit prisons was one of the answers that um that people were saying. Uh real answer gerrymandering. Yeah, that shit's crazy too. Um, one that I found out about that I had no idea was a thing, um, is that, uh, you can get married in some states when you are uh, between 14 to 16 years old and you're not legally allowed to divorce until you're 18 or have your parents consent. That shit is fucking crazy. You can actually do that in some states. How fucking crazy is that? That's in the US. That shit's fucking crazy. Please tell me Wisconsin isn't one of them, please. I don't know. I didn't look into it. I didn't look into it. I just heard uh I just heard that in this video. The the video was this guy um he, he posted this on like his, his Reddit uh, thread, he's a big YouTuber I guess, and he posted like, what is the worst thing that you can think of that is legal? And apparently he is from the US but he lives in Britain, um, but uh, that was that was among the answers. And that shit's fucking crazy. Shit's fucking crazy. I think the state that he had cited as a specific example was Massachusetts. <clears throat> All my video games are on blockchain. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking chowder heads. Ma'am. What else? What else was in that video that uh I don't even remember the guy's name. <laughs> I don't even remember his name. I've got streamer brain. Here, hang on a second. Worst thing that is legal. His name is Evan Edinger. Evan Edinger. Evan Edinger. It's, it's actually hard to say. Let's see. What, what are some of the things that he listed in this video? Let me skip ahead. Okay. Not the worst thing, but it used to be illegal for commercials on TV to be louder than the actual show. I actually didn't know that that used to be illegal. Or that that is now illegal, and it used to be legal. That's really interesting. That's actually a major complaint that I've had about Twitch, but there's not much that they can do about that on Twitch since everybody's stream varies in volume so, so drastically. Like, every once in a while, you go into a stream that's really quiet, and your volume is really high. And then after that, you go into another stream, and they're fucking screaming at you. Now they speed them up to give them the perception of it being louder, they always find a way. That's crazy. That's crazy. I wake up at 3 a.m. because of fucking ads. What kind of goddamn HBO Skinamax bullshit do you have on your TV? Cough poo. I think that my stream is pretty loud. I keep my stream relatively loud so that you can... I, I feel like if a stream is really quiet, it can be hard to reach a volume that you're comfortable with it being. But if a stream is too loud, you just lower the volume and then it's like, ta-da, you know? Everybody can lower the volume to the point that a stream is comfortable. It's hard to, if the stream is too quiet, raise it up. 
You fall asleep to streams and the mid rolls are loud. Oh, I gotcha. Um, I think at this point, because mid rolls are gonna become like a really common site wide thing in the future, um, you, you should probably just get Twitch Turbo. You know, I know it stinks, but I, I have Twitch Turbo for that reason. Um, yeah. Yeah. Fuck ads on Twitch. <laughs> What's up, Blue? How's it going, dude? I am doing a pretty decent. Twitch Turbo is worth it, even for Canadians. <laughs> Loud is better than too quiet, just like cold weather is better than hot weather. That, that's a pretty contentious point, but I mean, I'm from the, the harsh northern region, so I'm pretty used to cold. <laughs> I'm pretty used to it being chilly. We're not all rich streamers, Laser. Laser, <sighs> $11 a month is just too much for me, man. <laughs> Says the tier three sub. <laughs> you can put on more layers, you can only take off so much. <laughs> Dude, I love that pouty emote, man. What, what's uh, what's the next thing that he talks about? Let me. I, I find this video to be very interesting. Here, let's see. Next topic. Oh, dude, I've talked about this one on stream fucking a thousand, 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 thousand times. Big businesses lobbying politicians in order to get bills passed in their favor. What are we even gonna do about that? <laughs> What are we even going to do about that one? <sighs> that one's exhausting. Now nah, it is the same IMO. You can put on more clothes when it's cold, when it's hot, uh, and you're already new. That tough luck. Yeah. There's something really, really satisfying, though, about when it's really hot outside and you come inside to the air conditioner and you're just like, it's just like standing in front of it. I heard somebody got turned for like 3,500 bucks. I remember Moist Critical putting out a video a while back that was like, this is all the money that it takes to uh, flip these pol politicians. We could just get a coalition of streamers together and bribe the shit out of them, you know? <laughs> yeah. Being from the EU, we don't even have air conditioning. Ah, I gotcha. Uh, alright. Let's see. Yeah, I really like Charlie. He seems like a super stand-up dude. I feel like there's just, um... There's such a strong possibility of like becoming a douchebag after you become super successful and rich and whatnot. It's really refreshing to see somebody who's like so obviously not a prick. <laughs> I really like Charlie. He seems like a super good dude. A dude that I went to school with is now a registered lobbyist. What's up, Space Fixin? How's it going? Uh, anybody who's just getting here, we are talking about things... We're, we're talking about the worst things that we can think of that are legal. <laughs> Which, it's it's because there's a YouTube video that I saw right before I started streaming today that was, that was just that. Caller ID spoofing. That, that's when it, that's when you make it look like you're calling from their area code, right? When you make it look like it's a call that they give a shit about and then you answer the call and it's like, hello. We would like to ask you about, you know, that is, is that what caller ID spoofing is? Am I understanding that correctly? A teacher from my school is now a registered sex offender. Hey, mine too, life. Mine too. That's, that's a pretty bad feel, isn't it? It's a pretty bad feel. 
His name was, um, Mr. Wallace. Yep. I remember one time my stat, my stats teacher came in and, uh, Mr. Wallace was like going to the bathroom or something like that. My stats teacher came into the room to his classroom and was like, Hey everybody. Yeah. What do you get when you combine Mr. Wallace with a potato? A dictator. <laughs> and then she fucking dipped and everybody was like, wow. <laughs> She was my favorite teacher I've ever had. I really liked her. Zai, thank you very much for the tier two of 39 months. Thank you so much, dude. Um, her name was uh, Mrs. Ketchum. She was fucking great. I really liked her a lot. Uh, let's see. What is next? <laughs> Okay, here, let, let's listen to what he has to say about this one, so that I'm not giving you guys crazy false information. Ash's mom? Yeah, maybe. Just so that I am not giving you guys a false info here. Let's, let's give this a, a jolly listen. So, I had no idea that this was a thing in the good old US of A, but it totally is, I guess. I always end up just having to block it, and then I just get another randomly generated number uh, for some reason from the same area. Child marriage. All right, I think that's probably going to be the one that wins it, especially considering this isn't just a thing around the world. This is a huge thing in the U.S. We have extra comments here to tack on child marriages and where they cannot legally divorce until they're 18. Found that out the other day. And then someone said, yeah, it was posted on r slash legal advice in Massachusetts. A child, 14, 16, I have to check about that, can get married but can't get divorced until 18 without parental consent. There was a guy posting because his cousin had been forced into a marriage and couldn't get out of it. Holy sh Never knew underage marriage was legal in Delaware until I was at work and a 23 year old coworker came in to use the phone to call his next base, Germany, to register his wife for high school, who was 16. Youngest you could marry in that state with parental approval. Yeah, I think his face pretty perfectly captures that one. Delaware and Massachusetts, huh? So this is like an East Coast thing? Where they're marrying off their children? What the fuck is this? I had no idea that that was a thing in, in America. That's fucking crazy. That is outrageous. Outrageous. Hey, uh, that's some Puritan hangover shit. Good old Puritan values. Oh man. That's fucking crazy. I never would have thought. Never ever would have thought that that was a thing. So I want to make sure that you guys didn't think that I was just talking out of my ass. Which I guess I do on a fairly regular basis, but you know. This time, I'm, I'm hitting you guys with facts and logic. Seems you missed something cursed. Yeah, yeah, you, you did. <laughs> yes, indeed, you did miss something cursed. Let's pretend, let's pretend that we didn't hear it. In better news, I made homemade pickles. I just had my first taste and they're fucking great. Hell yeah, brother. That's awesome. I googled it for Germany too. Apparently you can marry at 16 if you request it via court. Sounds fishy. Ugh. Have you played much Skeletal Summit before? Nope. Yesterday we played it for the first time ever. First time ever. And uh, I mean, you wanna see my stats page? It's pretty, pretty solid stuff. Um, let's see. Also, did you guys see, did you guys see that Joe Rogan shit? I don't know if he's like, I don't know if he's like, did I say scale the summit? <laughs> scale the summit. That, that's what STS was for me before uh, Slay the Spire, that's funny. Yeah. 
It, it's funny to fall back on uh, old acronyms like that without even realizing it. Um, and they actually kind of sound like the same thing, don't they? Because you're going up. But anyway, um, it's like it's like Mega Man, Majora's Mask, Mario Maker. I never know what people are talking about when they put MM. <laughs> uh, what was I just thinking? Oh yeah, did you guys see that Joe Rogan shit? I don't know if he's like clarified or anything, but man, that guy, that fucking guy. Great band. I love Skill the Summit so much. I fucking love him. Basically, Joe Rogan was citing a research paper from 2015 that he didn't understand. And basically what he was saying was, according to this research paper right here that I'm reading directly from right now, um, botched vaccinations can actually increase the spread of disease. And, like, he said this so confidently chest out you know like he always fucking does and the uh, person who wrote the paper reached out saying you are misinterpreting this wildly and that research paper is about chickens and I wonder if he's going to be like oh I'm sorry for saying that Now nah, that's old news now. Isn't that depressing? It's amazing how much more rapidly false information will spread than the uh, clarification about it actually being false. Like when people make corrections to false information, people don't see that. The uh, Somebody will say something false and people will run with it. And then later they'll be like, actually wait, I fucked up. And only like 5% of the people that heard the fucked up info will actually hear the retraction. It's frustrating. It's frustrating. <laughs> Correction, I do not. <laughs> Man, that's funny. If Rogan doesn't apologize. He all he just says, uh, "People don't listen to me. I'm a big dummy that moves on." Yeah, but he's a big dummy that millions of people listen to, and I feel like he should be aware of that. But who am I, right? All right. More shitty things that are legal. <laughs> We're starting out on like the most depressing note possible today. Not really depressing, maybe like just rage inducing, like old man yells at cloud, you know? Yep. <laughs> Let's see. Being penalized for calling out sick from work. Yeah, uh, that's a very American thing though. That's like a really, really, really American thing from what I hear. Um, like, <laughs> you, you call your boss, where is that illegal? It's legal is the thing. These, these are bad things that are legal. <laughs> these are bad things that are legal. <laughs> Not having your camera in the corner of your stream? Yeah, but wait until I start the game. Um, God, what was I? Oh, yeah. If, okay, so if you are not American, uh, then you might not understand this. It's like really, really anxiety inducing to call into work sick. It really is. We've just got this like fucked up work culture where people are, one, really proud of destroying their sanity for their employer for whatever reason. Like, Let's say that you work 40 hours a week. It is a very, very common thing for people to be like, 40 hours a week, huh? I remember my first part-time job. That's like a really fucking common thing in America. People are weirdly proud that they work like 70, 80 hours a week. And 
I, I'll never make sense of it because even when I had the opportunity to work like a shitload of voluntary overtime, um, I never did ever. And my boss hated me for it, but I like never did. <laughs> I used to work third shift and I worked 40 hours a week. That's what I did. My boss would come up to me and be like, hey, can you stay late today? I'd be like, nope. <laughs> I sure can't. Nope. You want me to stay until 10 a.m.? I'll pass. Thanks. Fuck you, you know? Um, but calling into work sick is like actually anxiety inducing because of that because people will start treating you like a lazy cunt and you'll call into work and you'll be like hey boss I, I can't make it in today I'm not feeling well and it'll be like that's the third time this year are you fucking serious you know and that's the way it is that's the way it is three times in one year unbelievable <laughs> well I guess I'll find a way to cover you <clears throat> Remember when I told you how much I'd hate you if you first tried a <laughs> Slay the Spire? <laughs> I'm sorry, Elhirion. <laughs> the Madge Man over here. <laughs> I hate feeling guilty for using my sick time, it's so dumb. It is dumb! It is fucking dumb. I mean, if you're calling into work all the time, then that's, that's a totally different thing than if you're, like, actually sick. But, like, the last job that I worked at, the, the sick policy, the absence policy was insane. It was actually insane. Um, so, it worked on a point system. Being late was the same point value as being absent. So therefore, if you were going to be late for work, you might as well just call in and tell them, hey, I'm not coming in today, you know? So there, there's already that, which was absurd, but it's seven points and you're fired. Seven points and you're fired, uh, and a point does not come off of your record until one year has passed from the day that you got it. So, you know, it was brutal. It was fucking brutal. Oh yeah. Land of the Free has no workers rights. One point, yeah, yeah, that point that you accrued lasts until one year has passed from the day that you got it and then it gets knocked off of your, your record. So if you got seven points, then you would get fired. Um, so if you got three points, then your boss would come up to you and give you a written warning that you would have to sign. And then if you got a fourth point after that, then I'm pretty sure nothing happened on that point. But the fifth point was a suspension. The sixth point was a huge suspension. And then the seventh point was just firing. <sighs> People are proud that they have four jobs and sleep one hour a week. Lunatics, if you ask me, 100% agreed. 100% agreed. That sounds inhumane, not gonna lie. Yep. I agree. You got a point for actually being ill? You wanna hear the craziest story that I have about somebody getting a point at work? You wanna hear the craziest fucking story that I've ever heard? Somebody getting a point at work? If you left in the middle of your shift, that was also a point. So like if you came into work and you were sick and then you went home during your shift, that was still a point because you were missing work. So somebody legitimately had a heart attack at work. Old man, heart attack at work, carted out in an ambulance, got an attendance point. Dead fucking serious. Shouldn't have had a heart attack, man. <laughs> That's just lazy, you know? Rules is rules. <laughs> People wonder why Americans can just snap. All of this is why I'll take the stress of self-employment any day. Yes. Yes. Um, and, and, you know... 
The, the thing is, is that jobs aren't even as fucking stable as people want to make them out to be. Like, people always be like, being self-employed is, is so much uh, instability. And I don't disagree that it's not stable, but, you know, your 9 to 5 isn't as stable as you fucking think it is. I can almost guarantee you it's not. Um, you're in almost, in almost all companies these days. Um, you are probably just a number as much as you wouldn't like to believe it. I can almost guarantee you that you are imminently replaceable. <laughs> I can almost guarantee it. So no matter how much you want to believe that like your employment is super stable, blah, blah, blah. You can get replaced like that. Garen fucking teed. Yeah, they don't they don't love you. I wish that they did. But, you know. Do you have an employee number? Then you are a number. <laughs> Agree, but thankfully I have a loud voice and there is no one as loud as my dumb ass at work to get things moving. Yeah, it's frustrating. But you know, them's the breaks. Is what it is. Is what it is. Your job will be posted before your obituary is. Woo! Yeah, last song was ahead on our way from Final Fantasy VII. I, I do have a Golden Sun song in here. It's this one. Is it time for another cheater run? Yeah, in a little bit. Uh, I work for one of the biggest insurance companies in the United States, and they just up and decided to lay off 10,000 people to bring stock prices up and buy a competitor. Facts. It's frustrating, isn't it? It's really frustrating. Like, here, you want to know how my last job went? Um... That this is the same job with the bad attendance policy where you can get a point for having a heart attack. Um, the the last job that I had, this is how this is how the job ended. Um, they worked us between um, fifty to sixty eight hours a week. Um, it was not at all uncommon for us to work 60 hour weeks. That was a very normal thing where we're, they were working us to death. We we're working so many hours and, um, I went off to MMC and when I came back from MMC, um, there were people that were like, Oh, Trent, we thought you quit, man. Uh, Hey, we're getting laid off on Thursday. And I was like, Oh, well, that's not good. Um, and then they told us the reason that we were getting laid off was because we overproduced and they had too much inventory that they were not slated to sell. <laughs> so they worked us into the ground and then laid us off because of it. Yeah. <laughs> that happens more often than you think. Yeah, I I can't even disagree with that. I can't even disagree with that. I quit my job as an Amazon accounting assistant last month. I was super burnt out to the point that it was starting to get hard to uh, get uh, get up out of my bed. Amazon is great, but if you can take more than four years of it, you're probably a psychopath. Yarp. At my old place, there was a union to block that kind of shit. Yeah, um, the thing is, is that a lot of workers' unions, what they do, in my experience, is, um, they make sure that they maximize the union's profits. What they do is they make sure that all the people are getting the maximum amount of money possible. But- Balls are huge. Your meat is massive. And everybody loves you. <laughs> Sunan, thanks for the tier 3 16 months. Hang on a second. Uh, so unions don't really protect you. They protect your paycheck. Um, in my experience. And I know that there are unions that are exceptions to that. Like, uh, like police unions and teachers unions and stuff like that. But um, the unions that I have worked with in factories... They are there to make sure that you make the most money possible and to make sure that like your healthcare benefits and stuff are good. Um, 
they don't really care about your workers' rights very much. So, like, like, when you accrue enough attendance points to get a suspension at the last place that I worked at, um, what happens is you have to go in front of, like, the bosses and stuff, and kind of have, like, we called it kangaroo court. Um, you would go in front of the bosses and, like, plead your case about why you shouldn't be suspended, and you would have a union rep there with you that would be, like, your public defender, kinda, and he would pretty much just stand there with his arms crossed and watch as you got ripped apart by the bosses and be like, good, all right, and then they just walk out. <laughs> so, <laughs> the, uh... The union does not give a fuck about your rights, in in my experience. They care about your paycheck, because it's also their paycheck. And that's about it. <laughs> Which is upsetting to hear, but it is the way to, that it is. This reset alert is the only compliments that I get, and it keeps me going on a month-to-month -month basis. I'm happy to be here for you, dude. <laughs> You'll fail a run eventually. Dude, I'm one run in. Of course, Why? I'm going to fail a run eventually. Uh, Mario Papo, thanks for the two months of Twitch Prime. Welcome back. All right. Let's quit stalling and get into a run. Yeah, I'm uh, I'm sure I I'm probably going to lose this run. The game's not called Scale the Summit. I'll probably lose this run. All right, let's raise the volume back up to 37%, which is what it was at yesterday. People said that it was good. Then, stats. Is it run history? Is that where we... I swear there were more stats here yesterday, but maybe not. Oh, they're at the bottom. Aha. There you go. See? Okay. Uh, standard. Okay, so we got another character now. The silent but deadly. Has less HP, starts with the same amount of gold, right? Less HP, same amount of gold. At the start of each combat, draw two additional cards. Okay. At the start, at the end of combat, heal 6 HP. I, I feel like this is like the beginner character. Wonder if they have the same amount of energy. A deadly huntress from the Foglands eradicates foes with daggers and poisons. Hmm. Okay. Alright, let's try the silent. Who the fuck are you? Greetings, I am Niao. Niao? Uh, I love the silent, they have probably some of the most interesting and fun decks, the silent is my favorite. I brought you back. Enemies in your next three combats have one HP or max HP plus seven. I just get to start out with a buff. I'll take the max HP plus seven. What if one of my next three encounters was an elite? Fuck. <laughs> one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, it was not possible. Okay. I'll keep that in mind though. <laughs> I will keep that in mind. <laughs> You can look at the map when you talk to him. Oh man, okay. I'll keep that in mind. Okay, so the map is up here. All right, good to know. 
That's neat. Okay, so I'm not gonna take this path because what's the point in going to a shop right away? Uh, I'm not gonna take this path either. Uh, hang on a second, I just heard my phone go off. It's probably my grandpa. Taylor, thanks for the eight months. Welcome back. Thank you so much, Taylor. You need failure. I think that Laser should let us backseat today just to fuck with Mellow. <laughs> okay. Hang on. I, I, I think that fighting elites to get relics is like super duper important. Are they even called relics? Whatever these things are. <laughs> Hang on. Relics. Okay, they are. All right. I think that fighting elites to get relics is like extremely important so I want to make sure that I get to elites but I want to get like the safest path up to them so let's see this way looks tempting two question marks before an elite this is like oops all fights so I don't think that that's the right choice mmm Although, okay, hang on. So I could go this way, fight this elite, go up here past the chest, and then rest here, and then go to another elite. That's not a bad choice. I think that that's what we're gonna do. So we're gonna take this path. Okay, what well, I, well, Jesus, that's a, that's a big first hand. We still start out with three energy, okay. I should have checked out my deck before I started. Hang on. So, strike, but it looks a little different with a dagger instead. Defend, it looks a little different with a cloak this time. So, it's all strikes and defends. Same as the other character. Gain eight block, discard one card. Okay. Deal three damage, apply one weak. And that one is just free. Cool. That's not bad. Nothing wrong with that. Okay. Uh, that's a pretty late bonfire. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I read what my relic did. I just forgot about it. <laughs> okay. Can gain eight block. Uh, okay, so this guy is just going to uh, use a debuff on me. So let's strike. <laughs> and strike. Wait, what? On receiving attack damage, rolls up and gains seven block. Okay, I did not notice that. Gotcha. All right, weakened, so we deal less damage. That's okay. He's gonna try to debuff me again. So we'll defend. Uh, will. And then this won't do anything. Okay. So, I might as well just end my turn. We are extremely weakened. Alright, so, we'll attack. Oh, you're not gonna curl up this time? Oh, okay. Well, see you later, bud. Goodbye. What do we got? Okay, dodge and roll, gain four block, next turn, gain four block. That's not bad. Gain five block, block is not removed at the start of your next turn. That seems really good. Deal six damage, apply three poison. Okay, hang on. Poison creatures lose HP at the start of their next turn. Uh, each turn, poison is reduced by one. Oh. That's really nice. So I'm definitely looking at either Blur or Poison Stab. I think I'm going to go with Poison Stab. Yeah. Okay. 
Uh, okay, you walk into a room to find a large hole in the ground. As you approach the hole, an enormous serpent creature appears from within. Ho ho, hello, hello, what have we got here? Hello, adventurer, I ask a simple question. The most fulfilling of lives is that in which you can buy anything. Do you agree? Hmm, at the end of your turn, gain one week. Thing is, is that I could pay to remove this at the uh, shop, couldn't I? Hmm. Hang on. Let's see. Where is the nearest shop? We're not going to get to a shop for a long, long time. It doesn't look like. Honestly, I don't think that I value the gold that much because we're not going to see a shop until even the next floor. So, nah, I'm good. A look of extreme disappointment. <laughs> I mean, I can't even fucking spend the money, asshole. Fuck you. Dad? Okay, so let's see. Uh, we can kill this guy. I think that we should probably just do that. Strike. Strike. And... Strike. Coward, huh? Yeah. Frail. Gain 25% less block. Okay. I don't care. Uh, he's just gonna debuff me, so I don't need to bother blocking. Yeah, exactly. And strike, and strike, and strike. Okay, I think that you're dead. Pretty positive. Smack, smack, smack. Dead. Okay. Flex potion. Okay, so calculate a gamble. Discard your hand, then draw that many cards. That seems quite good. Unplayable, if this card is discarded from your hand, you gain energy. Hmm. It's not bad. Kinda want more poison. I think we're gonna take the calculated gamble though. Yeah, I think we're gonna take that. That seems really good. Eleven, goddamn. This guy's not fucking around. I want to try to be as healthy as I can for the elite because I don't know what he's gonna do. One damage. He's gonna buff himself. Defensive. This enemy intends to block and use a buff. Okay. Laser gets a gamble, but we don't. <laughs> True. <laughs> True. All right. So let's. Oh, he's poisoned. This game is sick, dude. Okay. Let's see. Sucker Punch. Deal 7 damage. Apply 1 weak. 
Expertise, draw cards until you have six in your hand. That seems stupid good. Okay, as you come to a dead end and begin to turn around, walls slam down from the ceiling, trapping you. Three faces materialize from the walls and speak. Forget what you know and I'll let you go. I require change to see a new space. If you want to pass me, then you must grow. Okay, remove a card from your deck. Transform a card in your deck. Upgrade a card in your deck. I think we're gonna upgrade. Seven, okay. Discard your hand, then draw that many cards. I think that getting rid of the exhaust on this card is probably what we're gonna go for. Yeah, let's get rid of the exhaust on this card. Satisfied, the walls in front of you merge back into the ceiling, leaving a path forward. Hey, it's Buff Satan. <laughs> we don't mind Buff Satan. Buff Satan, he's fine. You know, he's fine. Uh, okay. So let's strike and strike and uh, gomble. And I was hoping that I would get to poison him. This is free. Do that. And just strike. Yeah, so what exhaust does is it means that I can only use it one time and then I have to wait until the next fight starts to use it again, so. Okay. So let's. Okay, so anytime that I use a skill card, right? Whenever you use skill. Okay, so that's skill. So let's poison him. Let's strike him. And then we'll let him raise his attack once. And we will then lower his attack. That's good. And we'll end our turn. Unless. Hang on. This would. Mm, do I have anything else that I can play for free? Let me check. <laughs> nope. Just check him. Let's, should we flex? Nah, I don't think we should flex. Okay, I can gain eight block from this. Maybe I should flex. Yeah, sure, let's flex. Then we can give him two hefty smacks. And then he's gonna gain a little bit of attack from this, but I'll block a lot more than he gains. If we get lucky, we might be able to kill him this turn. Okay, so... Deal three damage, apply one weak. Six damage and poison. So now he's got four poison on him. All right, he's dead. Feels good, man. All right. Hey, we like the regal pillow. Nothing, nothing against the regal pillow. Okay. Uh, dagger spray. Deal four damage to all enemies twice. That's not bad. Uh, deal three damage five times. Hmm. Okay. Uh, wraith form. Gain two intangible at the end of your turn. Lose one dexterity. Reduce all damage taken and HP loss to one. Reduce all damage taken and HP loss to one. So I'll get two of those? Huh. 
That sounds really good. Yeah, I think I'll take that. Laser sounds like my wife when she goes to Target. Pillows? I'll get them all. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's see, let's see. Okay, so... The guy who's gonna deal 9 damage, obviously, I would prefer to get rid of. Um, okay. See if we can get the uh, neutralize. Hey, hey. All right. So now he's only going to deal six, and he will die very easily next turn. Nothing wrong with that. Okay. So we're going to take 10 damage this turn. Sucks a little bit. Okay, so we can kill this guy. He's dead. All right. Okay, I wonder if... Let's see. Wonder if poison applies even through uh, shields. Suppose we can try. It sure do. Let's go. All right, that's sick. Prime gaming and Mr. Moral, thanks to the eleven months Twitch Prime. Welcome back. Fat gremlin, damn dude, fucking savage. Yeah, yeah, I won my first run. Um, felt good, man. Felt real good, man. Let's just kill this guy. We don't like him. Two pillows each person max. This fight's just tedious. And I think it's mostly my fault. I think it's mostly my fault. It's a lot less unga bunga than the other character, yeah. It's probably why I excelled with the other character is because <laughs> Unga Bunga is kind of my MO. <laughs> it's what I do. Okay, alright. Draw one card, discard one card. Uh, if this card is discarded from your hand, draw two cards. Hmm. I've only got one card that discards cards though, so that doesn't synergize well yet. Hmm. I think I'll go with this, because it's free. Modern day caveman. It's kinda it's kinda what I do. Okay, so they all have curl up. This guy's gonna try to deal six damage to me, so let's poisoned. Strength. 
strike. And oh, one more strike. Put weak on this guy. And all right. Full unga, full bunga. That's, that's I'm all about it. All about the full unga, full bunga. That's really interesting. If you can't handle me at my unga, you don't deserve me at my bunga. <laughs> you guys are fucking dumb. Okay, so this guy's dead. This guy is alive, unfortunately. But he's looking like he'll be dead pretty soon. Yep, dead. Okay. Okay, uh, gain four block for free. Nothing wrong with that. At the end of uh, your turn, retain up to one. Retained cards are not discarded at the end of turn. Huh. Deal seven damage, apply one week. This is run number two, yeah. Uh, I need more ways to deal damage, so I think that I'm gonna take this one. Okay. Now, I wanted to go this way to go up to the fire and then go over to the elite. So, right her. Okay, 75 gold, not bad. Letter opener. Every time you play three skills in a single turn, deal five damage to all enemies. Cool. He's going to deal 13 damage. Okay, he's going to deal probably what? That's going to be like 11 damage. Wow, only 9. Holy crap. I can reduce that down to 0. Cool. <laughs> I like it. I like it. Okay, let's see. Deal six damage. Let's. I'm really glad that we got rid of the exhaust on that because that's really good. Cool, cool. I got Slay the Spire for my phone so I can play it anywhere. <clears throat> okay.
I mean, they both do the same thing, really. I bet if I can't discard a card, though, then I probably can't use that one. Oh, shit! I dealt damage to him because I used enough skill cards in a turn. That's cool. <laughs> That's really cool. <laughs> All right. You get more poison. Uh, deal eight damage next turn, gain an energy. Not bad. Deal eight damage, draw a card. I kind of want more poison. Quick slash doesn't sound bad, but I think we're going to go with poison. As you make your way down a long corridor, you see a banana, a donut, and a box floating about. No, dot, dot, dot. Upon closer inspection, they are tied to strings coming from holes in the ceiling. There's a quiet cackling from above as you approach the objects. What do you do? Obtain a relic, become cursed with regret. At the end of your turn, lose HP equal to the number of cards in your hand. I'm going to go for the relic, dude. What do we get? Start each combat with four plated armor. Okay. Uh, okay, so I'm pretty low on health and I'm not confident yet with this character at all. I'm not confident with this game. <laughs> so this will fully heal us thanks to our, our pillow. Or almost fully heal us. Plated armor is the one that like, so I think it lowers by one each turn, but it keeps on coming back or some shit, something like that. Oh, fuck this guy. This guy sucks. Um. I really like this wraith form, dude. The wraith form seems really good. Aya. Okay, so let's strike and strike and neutralize and end my turn. I'm pretty sure that this guy can escape with my money, so I really want to kill him before he can do that. Oh, we're going to poison stab. We're going to draw one card and discard regret. And then we'll strike and defend, I guess. Poison and a poison and he's gonna take eight poison damage. So he's dead at the start of his turn. All right Sayonara son I wish I could just discard my regret same Glass knife deal eight damage twice decrease the damage of this card by two this combat Hmm that seems pretty good. Why are there three of them? I don't like that at all. Hmm. Let's see. Oh, this elite. Oh, no. He's so fucked. <laughs> All right, let's see. Let's drink our strength. And then, um, let's try to get rid of one of the debuffers. Hey. They're not poisonable, huh? Okay, so this guy's dead. That's good. Kind of 
Okay. Alright. Um. So let's. Negates one debuff, I gotcha. All right. Uh. <clears throat> cool. Brass Rock, thanks for the six months. Welcome back. Thank you very much. Appreciate that continued support. Okay, so you're dead. Maybe we can get a free card, but then again, maybe we can also get regret, so I'd rather not do that. I'd rather actually not do that. Okay. So we got two dazed. Not that big of a deal. damage. I watched you win yesterday. That was incredible. Thanks, Asterisk. I felt pretty damn good about it. Felt pretty damn good. Oddly smooth stone. <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> Start each combat with one dexterity. Cool. Whack. RDFA. Thanks for the seven months. Welcome back. Thank you so much. Deal seven damage X times. That could be really good. Okay, deal five damage if the enemy has weak gain energy and draw a card. I think I'm gonna go with uh, the deal seven damage X times. Like if we buff our strength a little bit, then this could end up being stupid good. We're doing pretty well on health, so I'm going to smith. Uh, gain three intangible at the end of your turn, lose your dexterity. That's three turns where I can only take one damage. That seems really stupid good. Hmm. I think that that's what we're going to go with. Deal 10 damage X times. God damn. Draw two cards, discard two cards. I think we're going to go with Wraith form. Because that's three turns where I can only take one damage. Alright. We haven't seen this boss yet. Hexa Ghost. Alright, what do you do, Hexa Ghost? The enemy's intentions are unknown, but he's not attacking. Okay. Um... Let's see. Well, if you're not attacking, I don't know if I want to use Wraith form yet. I think that we're just going to start trying to chunk away at the enemy. So let's poison. Apply some weak. We use this because it's free. Then, uh, we'll discard this because we obviously cannot use it. Um, draw cards until you have six in your hand. See if we can get it more poison. No, no more poison, but more weak. Nothing wrong with that. All right, enter. You love it so far? Me too. Me too. This game's really fun so far. All right. Alright, so he buffed himself.
And so we're pretty well armored, but that's uh, it's a lot of damage incoming. Twenty-four, so we're gonna take ten damage. Okay. So I can deal 21 damage with that, but I'm going to take a lot of damage from uh, regret, so I'm actually just going to use all of my strikes. Strike, 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 zero. Hey! <laughs> He's too smart. Okay. Okay. So let's... Okay, we can gain 9 block, which I, I don't mind that. Obviously, discard, and then we'll do this, and we'll strike twice, okay? pretty intimidating the way that the music started up as soon as uh, it gained the little flames that went around it. I kind of like that. Okay. And then we'll poison. And we're gonna gain enough armor from our, our plated armor, I think. So I don't have to defend. Yeah. Okay. But I'm gonna get debuffed, right? It's another burn. Alright. Okay, uh, so let's... Okay, defensive, this enemy intends to block and use a buff, okay. So let's Glass Knife. No reason not to use this, um, okay, confirm. Cool. The real question is, why is this stone so smooth? I don't know, it freaks me out a little bit though. Let's Wraith form. And neutralize, and end turn. Okay, so we can deal 21 damage with this, which I think that we will do. Okay, and then, and turn. All right, so let's do this, and fuck. At the end of your turn, take two damage. Okay, um, get rid of that. And then we'll... It was the same regardless of what I had done. Okay. So we're gonna take three damage. No, we're gonna take four damage. Because two from this, two from this. Gotcha. Oh, wait a minute. I still have Wraith form. Ha! Goddamn. It's a lot of burn. Burninating the countryside. Huh, all right. Uh, poison, strike, and strike. Poison, weak. This, this makes me nervous, because I don't want to accidentally draw a bunch of curses. So I think that what we're going to do is... We're going to do this. Discard this. Gain two block, and turn. Cool. No more burn into the ground. We're, we're done burn into the ground. <laughs> Alright, Sucker Punch, deal 3 damage, 
And you are dead, sir. Goodbye. Cool. All right. That wasn't so bad. Not so bad. Gain energy, draw two cards, exhaust. For free? Uh, okay, that's good. Another wraith form. Hmm. Choose a card. Next turn, add three copies of that card into your hand. Hmm. I think I'm gonna go with Adrenaline. Adrenaline seems really good because you get two cards for free and an energy. I think we're gonna go with that. Uh, exhaust means that you can use that card once for combat and then it's gone until the next combat. Okay, so we've got... During boss and elite combat, we already had that yesterday. We really liked that one. At the start of your turn, draw two additional cards. Start each Prime combat confused. Gaming. Uh, confused whenever you draw a card, randomize its cost. That seems like something that is for uh, experienced players. I am not that. Samus fan, thanks to the 29 months of Twitch Prime. Welcome back. Holy shit. Confused is hilarious and sometimes it works out really well. Uh, Black Star, elites drop an additional. <laughs> Okay, so now we have to find the path that has the most elites. Okay, so if we go... Uh, Zwiggy, thanks for the 14 months. Thanks for the content. Glad you're digging the game. I am digging the game. The game's a lot of fun. It's very cool. Okay, so let's see. Elites, where are you at? So there's one right there right before a bonfire, which I think is good. There's a second one right there. So if we were to take the left path, it looks like we could get three of them, but it'd be a lot more dangerous. It'd be a lot more dangerous. Not a single bonfire. Hmm. Dot, dot, dot. Hey, Laser Belch. Dot, dot, dot. You chose the Black Star. You must embrace it. The Black Star Dragon Balls. But you're full HP. You got this. I I'm not worried so much about, like, the first Elite. It's more the second Elite. Because, like, you fight Elite, question mark, and then you fight another one right afterward. Which, that could be rough. Um, and then you'd fight a third one also without healing. But that'd be six relics. You know what? Fuck it, dude. No guts, no glory, right? Let's uh, let's take the left path because there's a shop right there. So we're gonna go here, question mark, shop. And then we're gonna go fight, fight, elite. Question mark, elite. Chest, question mark, fight, question mark, a question mark, elite. <laughs> All right, we're doing it. I'm committing. Okay, barricade. A block is not removed at the end of its turn. Okay, it's a 40 block? Jesus Christ. Okay, that's tight. Draw two cards, exhaust. Gain an energy, though. Okay, let's see. So we're going to... The last knife. Deal six damage, apply some poison. Be prepared. I can strike two more times. Sure, why not? And strike. And strike. And neutralize. Cool. Alright. And it's got an artifact. Jeez. So I didn't even poison it. It had multiple artifact. That's crazy. Jesus Christ! <laughs> <laughs> Fucking DPS check. 
Okay. Okay. First time seeing you play this. Have you gotten a win already? I have. I have. We uh, we won on our first run yesterday, which was pretty sweet. It was pretty darn sweet. Magic. <laughs> I'm sorry, guys. I'm sorry. I'm not sorry. <laughs> nope, not sorry. Not sorry at all. If I do this and then this and then this, then I deal damage to you, right? Yar, okay. And then uh, we can deal damage and apply weak. Cool. And then I can take a buttload of damage because I'm a fool. That's four damage. Sucks. Oh, wait a minute. Still only one because of Wraith form. That's pretty cool. Okay. So now Glass Knife. Poison. Strike. Cool. Any losses today or this is the first run? First run. <laughs> First run. I have not played this character at all before, and <laughs> Bama Pop. Thanks for the two years, dude. Good to see you. Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you very much. I appreciate that. <laughs> okay. Let's see. Uh, all out attack plus deal 14 damage to all enemies discard one card at random at random Okay, I'll make sure that that's the last one that I use if I take that at the end of your turn retain up to one card All enemies lose six strength this turn exhaust Whew. I think we got to go with all out attack Yeah Cool <laughs> What's that cow? It's funny. I like the cow. Ayaria, thanks for the six months. Thank you so much. Nice new badge. Ay, 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 Aria. <laughs> uh, okay. A gremlin is madly shuffling cards on a table. This monster seems to be a harmless one. You approach him out of curiosity. 12 cards. Match them to keep them. Five tries, no do overs. Are you ready? Let's start. Oh, Jesus. Forethought. Neutralize. Okay. Dagger throw. Neutralize. Okay. Neutralize, neutralize. Caltrops. Forethought. Okay. Okay. It's about as well as I could hope to do, I guess, without being obscenely lucky. You complete the gremlins game and look up. He disappeared? Okay, so I don't know what forethought is. What was forethought? Put a card from your hand to the bottom of your draw pile. It costs zero until played. Hmm. I mean, we got two cards that both cost zero. So I'm pretty okay with that. I'm pretty okay with that. Let's see what we got. Welcome! It sounded like he said fuck off. <laughs> oh, fuck off! Alright. So, uh, what do we got here? Whenever an enemy dies, transfer any poison it has to a random enemy. Cool. That seems really good. We already know what Dreamcatcher is. We had that yesterday. Uh, at the start of each combat, apply four poison to all enemies. Hmm. Reduce the cost of all cards in your hand to one this turn. 
At the start of your turn, add a random colorless card into your hand. Uh, infinite blades. At the start of your turn, add a shiv into your hand. Hmm. Did you realize you can get rid of cards here as well? Yeah, yeah, I see the card removal service. So, I mean, could I get rid of... I could get rid of regret. That would be good. So, I think that I will do that. My favorite color is blue. How about you? Uh, my favorite color is shut the fuck up. Please. My god. All right, we're going to take the specimen. We're going to take enlightenment. And we're going to remove... Oh my god, perfect. We're going to remove regret. Confirm. Okay. And we got zero gold. <laughs> All right. Streamer is so toxic. Okay. Nice. Six block. Um, he's only gonna deal two damage to me. Ah, fuck it. He's gonna deal zero damage to me. And end turn. What the fuck? I am. Neutralize. Cool. I app had a stroke. The funnel is mad good. Not too bad. Reduce the cost of all cards in your hand to one this turn. Ridiculous. Ridiculous. I should have used neutralize first. That's fine. Okay, so then we're going to a glass knife and nope, use that last. Poison stab, all out attack, and turn. Okay, um, we will defend and strike and all out attack. Goodbye. Okay, draw four cards, discard one card. That seems obscenely good. Um, deal 12 damage. If you have discarded a card this turn, gain uh, two energy. Hmm. So that's just like a free 12 damage if you've discarded a card. But draw four cards, discard one is like too good to pass up on, I think. Yeah. Okay, malleable. What's that mean? Upon receiving attack damage gains three block. Uh, block gain increases as malleable is triggered, resets to three at the start of your turn. Hmm, interesting. Hmm. So, is this gonna trigger it twice? Yep.
You personally, this guy should have been an elite. Damn. Seems pretty nasty. Hmm. All right. Neutralize and neutralize. And cool. They just gave him like way too much attack. Yeah, seven times three is pretty rough. That's pretty rough stuff. That's mean as hell. That's poison. And we can deal 14. Hey, all right. Yeah, yeah, it's like the combination of like really strong attack and really strong defense. That's that's really rough, for sure. How come it doesn't tell you in this card that you're gonna get like dazed when you use it? Maybe if I had known that, I don't think I would have taken it. Seems a little obnoxious. Oh, that was the power of the last enemy? Ah, oh, my bad. All right. Man, this this enemy is absurd. Yeah, this enemy is super absurd. Okay. Five times three. Let's defend. We're gonna take 10 damage still? Jesus Christ. Wow. This enemy's gnarly. This enemy is super gnarly. Uh, it's also super dead. Goodbye. Nice. Honestly, double his health and he could have been a first act boss. Mm -hmm. Next turn, gain two energy. Seems pretty good. Sucker punch plus. Next turn, gain two energy. This has a lot of potential. I think I'll take that one. Oh yeah, that wasn't the elite. <laughs> now we're fighting the elite. Okay. All right. That's yeah. That's fine. So let's let's neutralize him because gonna deal a lot of damage. And then. Hmm. So we could get rid of one of his minions, maybe. Let me use expertise. Yeah, that's what I was hoping for was poison stab. Now this guy's dead. And... Gain two dexterity. I might want to use that. Yeah, this is my first run with the silent. Okay. He's not attacking. Let's keep on applying weak to that guy.
Okay. Mm Charging up. Here it comes. Ready for the real thing. 28, huh? How about that? Let's see. How about that? Okay, and then end. Yep, this is harsh. This is real harsh. So we don't know what he's doing, but he's not attacking. That's good. Let's drink this. Last knife. He's probably calling in more goons, honestly. This is the easiest act to elite, in your opinion? Yeah, calling in more goons. That's what I figured. Okay, so we want to get rid of this guy because he gives us weak, and I don't like that. Uh, let's discard this hand. Every elite is based on countering certain decks, so every single one can be a run under. Oh, we got five energy this turn. Let's definitely use that. Let's uh, weaken him and poison him and... See if we get a zero cost. We didn't, but the intentions were there. <laughs> We all know he's just gonna win. I took like the most dangerous path I possibly could though. So, angry. Let's see, it's a deal 21 damage. And then he's going to take, all right. I think that this is the play. And then we end our turn. Charging up. Okay, uh, gain energy, draw two cards. Please give me something I can kill him with. You gave me something I could kill him with. Thanks. Run! All right. Cool, all right. So we got wing boots. You may ignore paths when choosing the next room to travel three times. I can do fucking what? Upon pickup, upgrade two random skills. Defend and enlightenment plus. What did Enlightenment Plus do? Okay, hang on, hang on. Reduces the cost of all cards in your hand to one this combat. What did it do before? I thought that's what it already did. <laughs> did, it, did, did it exhaust before? Oh, this combat. Oh, wow. <laughs> I still don't know the difference between battle and combat. Wow. Okay. That's nasty. Okay. Gain eight block, discard, or draw two cards. That's ridiculous. Uh, yeah, that's what we're taking for sure. I 
I can tra- it said that I can like travel three times or something. You may ignore paths when choosing the next room. I, I don't understand what that means. I could fight four elites now. That seems like a really bad idea. I think I have to go. Oh, I can what? I can go over here. Oh, that's weird. I'm not gonna do that, but the fact that I could is kind of neat. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna do that. I think I have to choose the bonfire. Do it, do it. Uh, eat my butt. No. <laughs> Absolutely not. We, we have to take the bonfire, I think. Okay, I mean, everything in this uh, hand already is one or less, so no, we're not gonna... Okay. Hmm. Kind of hoping that it would pull out Wraith form. Alas, it did not. Next turn, gain two energy. Gain nine block. I feel like I should get rid of this guy just because he has lower health. Cool. <laughs> Gain an energy, draw two cards, exhaust. Okay. I was hoping that I would get a way to get enlightenment, but definitely I'm going to use that. And then we will poison, glass knife, all out attack, and turn. He's dead. Okay, I'm hexed. Whenever you play a non-attack card, shuffle dazed in. Okay, okay. I get it. Oh, man. More dazed. <laughs> it's not giving me any attacks, brother. Not giving me any attacks. All right. Oh, shit. Look at all that energy. <laughs> that felt good, man. Let's go. Okay, all right, uh, let's uh, poison and a sucker punch and you're dead, brother. That's pretty cool. Distilled chaos, we like. I'll play the top three cards of your draw pile. Oh, never mind. That's not what I thought it was, but it's pretty cool. I thought it was the one that just fills up all of your, your potions with random potions. Okay, add a random skill into your hand, it costs zero this turn. 
Deal 8 damage, next turn gain an energy. There's nothing wrong with that. Deal 12 damage, whenever you play a card this turn, the enemy loses 3 HP. Hmm. Seems good. I've already got a bunch of skills that cost zero. Hmm. Preemptive bonk. What you know, chats like uh, take choke me, daddy? Is that is that what I'm I'm seeing here? Hmm. <laughs> we are now. <laughs> Uh I'm going to take this one. Okay, I need to heal badly. Need to heal badly. Okay. Now Best path to take, honestly, is probably this. Meat on the bone. If your health is at or below 50% health at the end of combat, heal for 12 HP. Cool. I rake it. Bone on the meat. Okay. Um, I'm guessing that your shtick is that you just deal damage. And therefore, we should probably weaken you. Gain two energy next turn, I like. And then... We'll do that, discard you, and defend again, okay, because that dealt five damage. Watching this on the phone, I thought laser is a floating head for a moment. I just, I didn't want to be covering anything, so I, I am a little floaty right now, I'll admit. Alright, so let's, let's do this. That is, uh, unfortunate. That's okay, though. Weaken him. Strike. I'll I'll do. So I'm gonna defend and defend, and then that's gonna hit them both, and then we'll all out attack. Cool. Oh, it's because of the black shirt. I gotcha. Strength. We don't like that. We don't like that at all. Add a random skill into your hand. It costs zero this turn. Come on, baby. Unplayable. Thanks. Thank you. <laughs> All right, but we can we can use it. Okay. Good lord. Gain six block. Draw two cards. All right, I'm intrigued by this move. <laughs> intrigued by that move. God, why can't you ever give me enlightenment when I have wraith form? Draw a card. It's never enlightenment. <laughs> never! Okay. Okay, so they're not going to damage me this turn, so I might as well go all out. Okay. 
Lystra's thirsty for this combo. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's just cool, man. All right. What the fuck? Fuck that, bro. Didn't know I was going up against a goddamn Vestal. Hey, you're dead. All right, cool. Righteous. Peace, brethren. All right. And now you get his poison. <laughs> oh, that's sweet. That's sweet. Um... Okay. A nine block and discard a card. Okay, I need to see something. I need to see something. So I don't think that this will work. If I can't discard a card, then... Oh, it does. Okay. Nice. So if I just can't discard a card, it still functions. That's nifty. Uh, okay. Then you fuck you, bitch, fucking piece of shit. <laughs> uh, poison potion. Apply six poison. I rake it. Uh, slice is cost zero and deals six damage. That's pretty nifty. More poison. More poison. Mm, I've only got 183 gold. I'm not that interested in the shop. Let's take this. Will Smith. Did he say Will Smith? <laughs> Gain two energy, draw two cards. I like that a lot. Gain three energy next turn. Hmm. Put any number of cards from your hand to the bottom of your draw pile. They get cost to zero until played. I feel like we've got a few good options here for upgrade. Hmm. Gain two energy, draw two cards it is really not bad, especially because it's free. Yeah, I think we're gonna upgrade adrenaline and a proceed. Let's see. Sneck boy, Sneko, it's even his name. All right, I like it. All right, um, let's see, he's gonna do a negative effect on me. Draw four cards, discard one card. Let's do that. Never lucky. Oh hecko, it's a Sneko. Yeah. <clears throat> Sneko gonna recco. Okay. <laughs> hmm. Hang on, let's see if I can pull this off. There we go. <laughs> Just wanted to see if I could sneak in a little bit more cheeky damage. Yeah, I got it 50% off. I think it's 50% off until the 12th or something like that. Oh, am I confused? He confused me. That sucks. That sucks a lot. All right. Uh, I mean, I guess I'll just skewer him then. 
Eat it, bitch. Three mana strike, that's value. Tail whip. Now I'm vulnerable. Okay. Zero cost glass knife. Okay. Gain nine block, draw two cards. Let's do that. Zero cost wraith form. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> of course! Oh, Barb, come on! What the fuck? <laughs> That's funny. Gain two energy, draw two cards. Uh, zero cost, a poison stab. <laughs> uh, we'll strike and strike and defend and end turn. <laughs> it's always going to be beneficial for Wraith form regardless. I gotcha. That's pretty cool. I don't mind that. Three cost enlightenment. Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, whatever, dude. <laughs> whatever. All right, we'll poison, we'll strike, and he's almost dead, but not quite. Give me something, baby. You didn't give me nothing. <laughs> you gave me not shit. The three cost neutralize. Oh, yeah. Yeah, brother. Fuck yeah. It's okay. He's dead anyway because of poison, but... I wanted to do the killing, okay? The knife that cuts on its own over here. Gain four block. Deal 12 damage. If you have discarded a card this turn, gain two energy. Draw two cards, discard two cards. I'll take that. Is there anything that I really feel like I should upgrade? <laughs> Gain three energy next turn would be super sick. Oh my oh wa mo shindu. Nani? Hmm. I could make this deal ten damage x times. That seems really good, especially if we're getting more energy. Mm. Yeah, I think I'll upgrade Skewer because it can deal so much damage. Okay. Proceed. Hey, we've already fought this guy. Painful stabs. He adds wounds to my deck. I remember that. Okay, so if we use Wraith Form right now, then he's not going to be able to... Alright, hang on. Here, let's do this. And then let's do this. And then let's do this. He's not going to be able to deal any damage to me um, this coming turn. Because I've got the plate armor thing. Mm. We could get some zero cost shit going and too bad. All right. Quit cheating to make yourself stronger. Give the enemies a chance match. I'll probably die to the next boss or something. I'll probably die. All right, let's... Let's neutralize. Acrobatics. One times three, so we don't need to defend. Neutralize again. 
Poison stab, poison stab, strike, strike. <laughs> Skewer plus. Okay, do I have any way to add? All right, hang on. Let's see if we can get anything cool. Tactician, unplayable. If this card is discarded from your hand, gain energy. Woo! All right. Yeah, we don't need those. So this will deal 40 damage. Pretty cool. See if we can draw anything that we can play. We can, we did not. <laughs> Laser is RNG manipulating. <laughs> yep, I sure am. You caught me. All right, gain six block. Draw two cards. A and R Son, thanks for the thirteen months. Had to resub for the god tier emotes and strictly mediocre gameplay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, okay. Neutralize. Outmaneuver. Glass knife. Okay, so he's gonna hit me twice, I think, right? Yeah, he's gonna hurt me twice. But we can all out attack for free. And turn. So, two wounds. Two wounds. Oh, yeah, okay, I was gonna say only one wound. All right. Let's uh, sucker a punch you. Let's do that. Okay, these both do the same thing. And cool. Oh wait, I still had energy. Shit, I thought I didn't for some reason. Don't know why, but I thought that I didn't. Uh, all right, you're dead. Good night, sweet prince. So long, farewell. Okay, let's see. At the start of each combat, heal two HP. Cool. At the start of each, start each combat with an additional energy. Also cool. Okay, uh, next turn, your attacks deal double damage. Oh, that makes sense, Kotaku. At the start of your turn, draw one card and discard one card. Tools of the Trade sounds really, really, really good, but Phantasmal Killer has a lot of potential. I'm all in on potential, baby. Okay. I need to see. Phantasmal Killer, where you at? So it makes it cost zero? Okay. I was looking at the description like, ah, uh, <laughs> it doesn't change anything. Hello? All right. Uh, I am going to be a bitch and rest. Okay, so he's got three artifacts, so we're not going to be able to poison him. Okay. Okay, let's see. Bouncing Flask. Apply three poison to a random enemy three times. Hey, goodbye to your artifact, asshole. <laughs> Whoa. Feels good, man. Okay. Uh, throw that shit on him. Apply six poison. That's a lot of poison.
I mean, I don't know what he's gonna do, I guess, but... Oh, hey, we dealt five damage still. Ha! Ah! That's funny. He's got mini owns. I don't like that. Double neutralize. Outmaneuver. Um... Deal 10 damage twice. I don't know what his minions are gonna do, and that worries me. But they do have a lot of health. Ah, screw it. We'll take out the minions. Oh, that's nasty. That's nasty. Okay, let's see. On death, the glass knife is going to be returned to my hand. Okay. Okay, we gotta use this. That is nasty. Okay, nine block and draw two cards. Really good. Okay, we can attack three times. One, two, three. Cool. All right. All right, buffed himself with three strength. All out attack here is great. Hey, there's the combo, baby. <laughs> <laughs> there it is! At last. Love to see it. Okay. Uh, alright. Attack that. Did 28 damage. Hell yeah. That's sick. Okay, we got our glass knife back, but unfortunately not able to use it. I didn't know I was going to take it back to my hand right away. Always take the highest rarity cards left in your draw pile. That's fucked, dude. <laughs> That's fucked. Okay, so prepared. Let's get rid of defend a plus and expertise, sure. And then we'll draw four cards, discard one. Okay, Phantasmal Killer. Okay. This is a pretty sick turn. <laughs> This is a pretty sick turn. <laughs> I, I feel pretty happy about that one. Feel pretty happy about that turn. Okay. <laughs> hey! Get fucked, asshole. <laughs> Beam <laughs> one damage. <laughs> oh my god, I am pleased. I am pleased. <laughs> All right, yep, 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 yep. He involved the 50 damage attack down to one. <laughs> uh, Cliffy, thanks very much for the raid, man. Uh, welcome in, Raiders. I think that you were playing Dragon Quest, right? How's that going, dude? Um, you're you're here just in time to see chat get very upset with me. I am doing maybe too well. 
<laughs> Ragamuffin, thanks for the 22 months. Welcome back. I think he's dead, right? Yeah, he's dead. He's taking 10 damage. <laughs> you love when Chad is upset? Me too. It makes me very pleased. Exactly, full madge. <laughs> Deal 20 damage. Nice. I'll take that. Let's go. Hey, welcome in, everybody. If you don't know who I am, I'm Blazer Belch. Uh, known aggressive cheater. Um, <laughs> or so my chat would have you believe. <laughs> uh, Dan of London, thanks for the gift of the Cliffy. Cliffy, welcome back. Hope you're doing well, bud. Good to see you. Your victory is tainted by your blatant cheating. <laughs> Alright, whenever you play a card, deal one damage to all enemies. W wait. Oh, that's a power card. That's just for the rest of a... Wow. Okay. Enemy loses X strength. Apply X weak and exhaust. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, Whenever you play a card, gain one block. Wow. Okay, these are both really good. I think we're going to go with a thousand cuts. Stop using a game genie on on Slay the Spire. I called it Scale the Summit earlier. <laughs> uh, the first time you discard a card each turn, gain an energy. Gain energy at the start of your turn. You can no longer rest at rest sites. At the end of your turn, you no longer discard your hand. This one seems really good for me, specifically. This one is like specifically tailored to my to my deck, but this one, yeah. But it's also like really reliant on me never taking damage again because I really think that that's like the only way that I can heal. I'm gonna go with Hovering Kite. Yeah, I'm going with the kite. All right. So, okay, yeah, I've only got one more charge on my boots. Okay, hang on. So this run, guys, we're getting two relics whenever we kill an elite. So I'm trying to do as many elites as possible. And it looks like that's gonna be the left path or the middle path. Left path has lots of bonfires, dude, holy smokes. Yeah, I think I'm going left path, it looks like. Alright, where's where's the merchants? Yeah, left path is fucking money, dude. Left path is money. By the way, this is only my second run that I've ever done in, in this game. This is uh, my first time playing as the silent. Bonfires, holy smokes, Keck W. Thank you, Dad. I appreciate your joke, Father. Uh, alright. Yeah, I think the word taken left path all day. So it's... We're gonna go here, then both the question marks, then here, and then the elite. Okay. Yeah, okay, left path. Okay, we've already fought this guy, but I don't remember what his shtick is. Strength up. At the end of his turn, it gains three strength. Okay. Okay, alright, so let's start out by... Let's poison him. He's gonna do 15 damage? Jesus. Defend, defend, and defend one more time because it'll deal damage. Feels good, man. D does Hitachi maybe have a cat? <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna time you out for your own health, bud. I'm gonna time you out for your own health. Alright. So let's neutralize adrenaline, phantasmal killer, a thousand cuts. 
Survivor, discard strike, use all out attack. Hell yeah. Dizzy Bomber, thanks for the seven months. Welcome back. Make sure you play a thousand cuts last. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, Dizzy Bomber. I appreciate it, dude. All right. Let's... I mean, might as well use Enlightenment because it's just going to deal damage. Um, Then we'll use a Poison Stab. Then we'll Defend. Then we'll use Glass Knife. And you're just about dead. So we're going to take six damage. Cool. Jeej. Sweep the leg. Apply two weak. Gain 11 block. Quick slash. Deal 12 damage. Draw one card. Card draw is king. He's human after all. I missed lethal. <laughs> Whatever. I'm surprised that I don't do that more often. Oh no, I didn't like these guys. I didn't like these guys at all. So these guys, their shtick is that um, you have to kill all of them at once because otherwise they come back to life. Yeah, all out attack is definitely king here. I agree. Let's neutralize. Let's poison stab. Let's poison stab the middle one too. We can deal five damage to each enemy. We use enough. Oh, I didn't use enough skills. Too bad. That's okay. Mm, I should have used my strike and then used all out attack. That's my bad. I kinda want to throw this at this guy too. Okay, and then we'll end turn. Laser's not playing perfectly. You guys are upset when I do play perfectly, and you're upset when I don't play perfectly. I can't win. Okay, um, I'm gonna use Wraith Form here. And end turn. That, that's just accurate. Yeah, I know. I'm aware. Playing perfectly? Madge. Not playing perfectly? Madge. Took you long enough to realize? No, I realized it long ago. Don't worry. I realized it long ago. Neutralize. I mean, I could kill one of them for this turn, cool. but like that doesn't deal. I mean, that doesn't do that much for me. Let's be prepared. We can. I mean, I can myrtleize one of them. <laughs> okay. Uh, Kaiju Marill, thanks for the 13 months. Laser is online. Madge, I'm sorry. I won't do it again. I 
I apologize for my words and my deeds. There we go. All right. I think that's GG, right? That was a ridiculous turn. <laughs> that turn was nasty. That was a nasty fucking turn. Uh, seven block for free. That's pretty cool. All enemies lose eight strength. Wow. All enemies lose eight strength. Deal 11 damage next turn gain an energy. I think that the mm, energy thing is going to be good. Okay. And how many other merchants are there? There's one way up there. We're going to go for that merchant, I think. Yeah, because we'll be off the path of the uh, elite if we do. Actually, wait, I can I can just get back onto the path. I have my cheater roots. Yeah, there's no reason not to visit the shop. Let's see. Buy something? Fuck you. <laughs> Deal 13 damage to all enemies exhaust. Die, die, die. <laughs> I like it. Okay. Apply 5 poison. That's not bad. Alright, let's see what this is. Whenever you obtain a curse, increase your max HP. Mm, I'm good. Um, upon pickup, gain 2 potion slots. That's not bad. <sighs> Uh, when viewing your draw pile, the cards are now shown in order. Wow, you could really... You could do some shenaniganery with that. So, we're gonna take this. And then, this turn, your next card is played twice. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Okay. Apply five poisons, really not bad. You like gold? Me too. I love gold. All right, all right, all right. It's too late. It's too late, Chad. I've made my decision. Homer, my face is up here. I've made my choice. <laughs> All right. Yep. Uh, you come upon a dapper looking cheery gremlin. It's time to spin the wheel. Are you ready? Of course you are. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Is that like max HP up? That would be dope. Ooh, a free heal for you. Heal full health. Cool. All right. Nothing wrong with that. What's that from? That's from uh, Eric Andre. <laughs> Eric Andre, the Wheel of Prizes. He spun the Wheel of Prizes when he had Sinbad on the show. <laughs> and the, the wheel just never stopped spinning. <laughs> the wheel just literally didn't stop. Love that shit, man. Oh, seen enough hentai to know where this is going. Deal 12 damage and draw a card. All right, hang on. So let's neutralize. Let's be prepared. Defend plus. Not bad. Defend plus. Sucker punch, lower him even by a little bit more. Quick slash. Gain nine block, discard one card. Let's apply five poison. Let's um, gain some block and discard a card. Very cool. Okay, 
Next turn, gain some energy. I like that. Poison. And just stab him, because he's not going to attack. And enter. Okay. Once you have the hang of it, you can speed up animations in the settings. All right. Constricted. I don't think that that's happened to me yet. What's that? At the end of your turn, take 10 damage. Oh, gross. I don't like that. Phantasmal killer. Neutralize. Uh, draw until six cards are in your hand. Okay, <laughs> Jesus Christ. And... Distraction. <laughs> Gain six block. Block is not removed at the start of your next turn. Hey, all right. He's going off. Nasty. I like that. that was, this is a fun game. It's a fun character. <laughs> it's a fun game, guys. I like it. This has gone excessively well, I would say. And then... Back. Cool! I have no idea what's going on, but it seems like Laser's cheating. Yep, yep, cheating! Eviscerate plus. Costs one less energy for each card discarded this turn. Deal nine damage three times. Apply three poison to a random enemy three times. If we use that on a boss, it would just be nine poison on the boss. That's really good. It'd just be nine poison on a boss. Hmm. But this has potential to be 27 free damage. I think we take the potential 27 3 damage. <clears throat> Alright, obviously we fight the elite. We've not seen this elite yet. Nemesis. What is your shtick? I don't know what your shtick is. Let's see. Let's. Glass knife. Wraith form and turn. He burned me three times. I don't like that. That's not nice. All right. Uh, flying knee. Let's see. Quick slash. We gain back an energy when we all out attack, so... Gain a block, draw two cards. Sure, why not? Let's see. And neutralize. And forethought. Cool! <laughs> Does anyone know the boss that he's fighting on this floor? Is it is it random? I feel like it has to be random, right? So it'd be like from a pool of a few bosses. We could deal 40 damage right here, which I think is probably the play.
Hmm. Yes, but you can see it on the map. Oh, okay. Did not know that. Hmm. I'll use that. I'll use a thousand cuts. Might not be the right choice, but... Um... Let's see. I don't need to defend. Okay. This is outrageous. <laughs> You've got to be shitting me. <laughs> You've got to be shitting me. Is that four times? I'm going to do four times damage on my next attack? <laughs> okay, let's find out. Let's find out. Nah, it's just doubled. Okay, that's... that's Okay. God, that was funny. Alright. Okay. Um... Oh shit, I thought it was draw a card. That's fine. That's fine. 45 though, god damn. He's not fucking around this turn. <clears throat> Let the other guy have a turn. Now he can have a turn. Ow. Three more burns. That's all right. Ah, uh, I mean, you're just dead if I use this, right? Yeah, you're dead. Oh, he's intangible. Oh, that's fine. I didn't know. Laser didn't know what an idiot. What a fucking idiot. That's what I get for not knowing. God damn. Did we go two for two? We're on the same run. He is intangible every other turn. There's still a chance he dies. There's definitely a chance that I die. I probably will, in fact. All right. Uh, whenever an enemy dies, gain an energy and draw a card. Okay. Enemies in elite combats have 25% less HP. All right. I like that. Draw cards until you have seven in your hand. That's pretty good. And draw four cards to draw. Uh, draw four cards. Discard one card. You thought that was the boss? No. Just an elite. Not this guy. God damn it. All right. Not this guy, man. I could run. If things get really dicey, I could just run.
This guy's easy for your deck, I think. attack okay well this sucks okay he's only gonna hit me for two all right that's not that bad Nah, he just is a countdown. You have to survive against him until he just dies. You just gotta survive until he dies. Alright, so... This turn, we can just, um... Let's use this. Alright. Thirty-two. That's not bad. All right. Draw four cards. Discard one card. All right. GG. GG. The combo, brother. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's no way he can come back from that. That's GG. Yep, yep. You should smoke bomb now, just to be fair. Nah, <laughs> absolutely not. Choke plus. Deal 12 damage, draw one card. I think that that's what we're going with. Yeah. Deal 12 damage whenever you play a card this turn, the enemy loses 5 HP. Actually, that's a lot of potential. That's a lot of potential with this deck because we can play like a fucking thousand cards in a turn sometimes. Hmm. Yeah, we've got a really big deck at this point. And I don't really like that very much, but uh, a lot of the cards are free and a lot of the cards automatically uh, kind of go into another card, so. That would be 5,000 damage laser. It would be, you're right. <laughs> All right, start each combat with three thorns. Okay. That's not too shabby. Raise your max HP by 10. That would have been sick. At the start of your third turn, gain 18 block. <laughs> Not bad. Combat reward screens now contain colorless cards and cards from other colors. Huh. All right, hang on. We could get another Eviscerate. All right, hang on. Unload. Deal 14 damage, discard all non-attack cards in your hand. Hmm. Yeah, you have to pay to remove cards. 
But I think that most of my deck works pretty well together, so... You just gained two dexterity in that one, that's not bad. Shut up, asshole! I'm fucking reading! Mm. Nah, I think I'll take footwork actually. I think I'll take footwork and then we'll, uh, is there anything else? Gain 12 block, nothing wrong with that. Apply three vulnerable. Now let's see. I think I'll take that. Oh, I thought I had enough money. Oh well, that's too bad. Just threw away a potion for no reason. That's okay. It's not like I was gonna need to escape anyway, right guys? Right? Right? <laughs> um... Yeah, this way. Okay, I don't know what you are, but um, you have 25% less HP. That's pretty cool. I don't know what Ascension is. We can get rid of one of the daggers, like, right away. Yeah. You're dead. We can get rid of both of the daggers right away, actually. Reptomancer. Reptomancer. Alright, gain nine block, draw two cards. Draw four cards, discard one card. Have I discarded any cards yet? Let's gain two dexterity. Let's draw four cards and discard one card. Nope, I hadn't. Okay. Is this your first round with the silent? Yeah. Chat called them a Venomancer, and that makes me think that if I use Venom on them or Poison on them, then that could be bad, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Okay. Didn't seem to do anything negative. Um. Alright, we got nothing out of that, unfortunately. Venomancer is something else? Okay. Just summoned back the minion. Not that big a deal, I don't think. Random skill terror. Let's see. Apply 99 vulnerable exhaust. Fucking what? <laughs> That's stupid. <laughs> All right. I'm going to use this. I might as well defend. And then, uh, end the turn. No. <laughs> Is Wraith form worth it? I always back out of picking it up. I have ways to make it, like, free. So, I think it's pretty sick. Uh, okay. 
Whenever you play a card this turn, the enemy loses 5 HP. The enemy's getting choked. <laughs> Next turn, gain two energy. Mm, this is a hard choice. Prime, Prime. gaming. I'm going to take the two energy, I think. Let's invest. All right, uh, Ryko Arts, thanks for the two months Twitch Prime. Welcome back. I really appreciate that. Thank you. I'm going to single-handedly keep the Copia market alive. <laughs> uh, Choke is back. Okay. All right, so... Choke right away. And then... Oh, wait, you're dead, aren't you? Oh, yeah, you're dead. Yeah, you're super dead. <laughs> okay. <gasps> Happy flower! Every three turns gain an energy. Hell yeah. Whenever you play three or less cards during your turn, draw three additional cards at the start of next turn. It's probably not going to help that much. Uh, gain one ritual. Gain strength at the end of your turn. Cool. Um... Deal 12 damage, draw one card, discard one card. I'm gonna stick with uh, what we've got right now. Then we're gonna go this way. Okay, um, a highly ornamented tomb can be seen on the other side of a floating path. Upon reaching the tomb, you notice a slot for gold coins with a scratched out inscription above it. Lose all your gold, obtain a relic. Yeah? At the start of each combat, apply one week to all enemies. Okay, nothing wrong with that. All right, let's see. I think that that's probably the one. <laughs> that's probably... Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> that's the one. Yeah. That's it. For sure. This should be called 2000 cuts now. Agreed. For sure. Okay. So let's... Neutralize you. Let's draw four cards and discard a card. Gain nine block and draw two cards. Sure thing. Prepared plus. Let's get rid of Sucker Punch and Strike. Let's Wraith Form and Eviscerate this guy. Cool. Forethought. All Out Attack. And turn. All right. Do you still have that potion to escape the room? Uh, no, I don't have the uh, smoke bomb anymore. He's gone. Uh, okay, uh, draw four cards, discard a card. Every time we discard a card at the start of a turn, we or any time we discard a card the first time a turn, we gain back energy, so that's pretty cool. Phantasmal Killer. Ugh. Oh, 
Let's poison stab this one. And we can kill this guy. The thing is, is that we have enough plate armor to not even take damage. So I'm not worried about murdering the enemies right now. <laughs> okay. Not too useful. Every time I get a cultist potion, I just forget to use it until either the boss is almost dead or I am dead. Okay. Uh, yarp. GG. Skip rewards. That's not what I was. No. Okay. Apply six poison. That's really not bad. Uh, let's get rid of this one. Take that. Flying knee is really not bad. Apply four poison and two weak to all enemies exhaust. That's not bad either. Gain eight block. Block is not removed at the start of your next turn. That's not bad either. Um, having ways to gain energy, I feel, is is probably not bad. Is there anything that I really feel like I should upgrade before I fight the boss? We already have that plussed up. This wouldn't be bad to upgrade, it would just be three probably, yeah. Mm. I think I'm just gonna heal. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna heal. Wraith form is already upgraded, isn't it? Yeah, it's already upgraded. And I don't have a second one. I think I'm just gonna be full health for the boss. The double damage one just makes it free. Which is cool, but... If it like tripled the damage... Then I would absolutely do it, but all it does is make it cost one less. I think I'm just gonna heal. Alright! <clears throat> Let's do it. I'm fighting a fucking donut, dude. Deca Dono. Donu? Deca Donu. <laughs> Deca Donu. Okay. Okay. Well, let's start out with this. And then this. And then this. And then this. 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 And. This. Okay. And cultist potion. Drag. And throw that at you. This turn, your next card is played twice. Okay. What's up, Laser? I heard you had a God Gamer moment on this earlier. Yeah, yesterday. Yesterday, um, we won on our first run. And we're at the last boss on our second run, so I would say we're doing pretty okay. Okay, um... Fantastic Killer, Prepared Plus. Um, yeah. Mm. Okay. 
Mm. Let's invest. I can feel the molding coming on. <laughs> Turns out Laserbotch is secretly the greatest Slay the Spire player of all time. Absolutely fucking not. I, I make mistakes all the time, but I feel like as long as you're like really paying attention, you can mitigate um, your mistakes at least a little. Let's see. Gain two energy, or gain energy and draw two cards. Okay. think we'll be able to here hang on let's get rid of that and then let's 24 times 5 24 times 5 that is 120 is that what that is hang on 24 times 4 is 96 plus yeah that's a lot let's let's do it all right, how about that? I could have done that twice, actually, and that would have killed him. I wonder what would happen. Hmm. Wonder what would happen. I w okay. I have a bad feeling that this is going to be like Trigger Twins, and that the first one that I kill is going to cause the second one to go into, like, Rage Mode or something. Let's see, though. Too bad. Wish that I had not done that now. Too bad. I'm guessing that that is what's gonna happen. I'm guessing that I'm gonna kill the first one and the second one is gonna get buffed heavily as a result. Mm, okay, let's start poisoning the second one. Let's start poisoning this one now. Did he have, uh, did he have artifact or was that... Maybe I just had a strike and I didn't realize. And I fucked up. That could totally be. 16 times 2, yikes. Okay. Hmm. Oh, wait, that's just a discard a card. I don't know why I thought it was draw. I've done that multiple times now. Okay. And then... Damn. That hurt. Sixteen armor, yikes! Super yikes! Okay, I, I need to kill off one of them. Okay. Fourteen damage, or one, or ten damage. Fourteen damage, it is. Okay. <clears throat> All right, he's very strong now. Let's gain some block. Okay. Then let's. Poison him. Deal 17 damage, draw a card. Okay. I 
All right. It's a lot of damage, man. Okay. All right. Um prepared plus Uh, another isms. Thanks for the gift sub to Holden McRoin. Hey, thanks. <laughs> Thank you. Had to, yeah. <laughs> So he's gonna buff himself. Uh, will this deal five damage? No. Damn. Okay. All right. Twenty-two times two. Okay, that's enough to kill me if I don't do anything about it. Goodbye, chat. Oh. All right. Well. GG. Yo. All right. G motherfucking G <laughs> Donut has been consumed. A deep, pulsing dread can be felt throughout the room. Is this the heart of the spire? The source of the evil? You prepare your daggers. You deal 761 damage, the heart squirms and bleeds. But is ultimately still pounding. Are your mightiest attacks not enough? You ask yourself. Have I been here before? Anonymous, thanks for the gifts of the Pokey. She's gonna show up one of these days. One of these days. Thank you, Anonymous. Really means a lot. Uh, you feel you have dealt a total of 1,556 damage to the heart. A total of 14,636,642,707 damage has been dealt by all who have challenged it. The heart pulses louder and louder as your consciousness fades. Victory question? Curse your cheating through a cunning use of checks notes learning the game mechanics. <laughs> 42 card deck. Well done, mate. This is amazing. 42 seems like a lot. My man. Yo, man. Great run. <laughs> Glad you're having fun with this game. It's so good. It really is. I'm really enjoying it a lot. Really, really enjoying it. Yeah, we're two for two. We're two for two. Unlock. Okay, so now we have Bane, Catalyst, and Corpse Explosion. <laughs> All right. Deal seven damage. If the enemy has poison, deal seven damage again. That's pretty good. Uh, Catalyst, double the enemy's poison. That's really good. Uh, Corpse Explosion, apply six poison. When the enemy dies, deal damage equal to its max HP to all enemies. <laughs> what? My man. Wow, GG, what a god gamer. I can only imagine how long it took Melody to do this. Thanks, All right, that these cards all seem really good. These cards all seem really good. All right, cool. New character. We got like weird looking Groot. Um, proceed. I want to see what the new character is called. Best class. All right, let me see what uh, the new character is. 
The defect. Even less HP? No, that's actually five more. Okay. The defect. 75 HP, 99 gold. Uh, combat automaton, which became self-aware. Ancient technology allows the manipulation of orbs. Starts with cracked core at the start of each combat. Channel one lightning. Hmm. Honestly, I call the red, green, blue, and spoilers. Hey, it only took me ten hours. One day, hell die, right? <laughs> hey, thanks, man. It's your favorite one. <laughs> this shit makes me so happy right here. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's really funny. That's really, really funny. Seven minute PB. I I am very pleased with that. I'm very pleased with that. I call them robot sword daggers and spoilers. Well, uh, GG, GG. I was hoping that we would be able to do another run today, but I don't think that if, if we do another run, then I think that maybe we wouldn't be able to finish Mega Man Zero 2. I have no idea how long that game is. So I, uh, shut the fuck up, Marathon. I think that we are going to, uh, switch over to Mega Man Zero 2, guys. Uh, chat name a video game. I wonder if I have Terranigma. Uh, I'll check, and if I don't, then it's Zedla. Um, okay, I'll be right back, guys. We're gonna switch games. I'm gonna play more of this tomorrow for sure. Um, this game is so sick. I'm really, really enjoying it. I hope you guys are enjoying watching it. So I will be right back with Mega Man Zero. The Peepo Mega Marathon continues. BRB.
wanted to laugh at Mail and Little. any sound for the title screen so we're gonna keep the music on for a little bit because I gotta eat my food I'm back <sighs> laser just looking at the chat like huh weird laser bro had me rolling <laughs> after after I took one damage from that and then I looked at chat and people were like that's supposed to deal 50 I was laughing <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> that's really fucking funny. <laughs> oh man. Yeah. Um. Hey, luck be a laser, right? anywhere near as lucky in real life as I am with video games. <laughs> I wish. I wish badly. The good burger today? It's, it's that good old Nutrisystem microwave burger. One minute and 30 seconds. All my luck went into my gaming prowess. <clears throat> what's punishing about Wraith form? What's what's punishing about Wraith form? You lose one dexterity every turn. Oh, okay. So you just have to end the battle fast. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You ate a box of Cheez-Its for lunch today? 
I'm here just because I like Mega Man Zero, not because of the streamer is sexy. Uh, is, is that my first ever Sundere uh, chatter right there? It's not like I like the streamer or anything. B Baka. <clears throat> Yesterday you ate a bag of goldfish for lunch. <clears throat> Man. Slay the Spire is fucking cool. Slay the Spire is really cool. I, I did not think that I would like it as much as I like it. I like it a lot. And not just because I always win. <laughs> it's just really fun. It's a fun game. Yeah, sure. <laughs> um, I don't know how close we are to 900. The closest that we've gotten is like 856 or something like that. Um, which is really, really good. Don't get me wrong, but um, recurring subs is a thing that you have to constantly keep pushing, which is frustrating. Because I know eventually, because I'm a very simple man, and I don't need like shitloads of money or anything like that. Um, I know eventually I'm going to reach a point with recurring subs where I'm like satisfied. I'm going to reach that point. But you're not allowed to do that. Because that number that you reach where you're satisfied will begin to dwindle if you don't keep pushing it. So you constantly have to keep going for more and more and more, and I don't like that. But... You know, it is what it is. How does this help with your recurring sub count? Absolutely, Sunan. <laughs> Absolutely. Constantly beg for subs. Got it. Um, I was actually thinking about recurring sub Mama. shit the other day. <laughs> Thanks, Sunan. I was I was actually thinking about that the other day, and um. What's this? Pyre? No way. Um. What's up, Golden? How's it going? Um. I was actually thinking about recurring sub shit the other day. And one of the reasons that, uh. Hey, shut up! <laughs> Street name Danny, thanks for the bits. And also, thanks for spamming, uh, Laser G in Eris' stream. I saw that shit. <laughs> I was watching. Um. No, I was thinking about recurring sub shit the other day, and one of the reasons that I really like recurring sub goals rather than just sub point goals or anything like that is because, uh, and bear in mind that this is a really, really normal thing across Twitch, so I'm not calling anybody out. This is a really normal thing on Twitch. So you, you can probably think of like a fucking dozen people off the top of your head that have had this happen to them. Um, but if, you, no, it's not smaller subpocalypse. It's, um, you don't have to hit the same goal twice. Um, you see loads and loads of people that this will happen to. Let's say they have, like, a really good stream where a few people are just really generous out of nowhere all of a sudden. And then they hit a bunch of sub-point goals, and then the subpocalypse happens, and suddenly they're really far away from their next goal. So you'll be like, let's hit the 2,000 sub-point goal, boys, let's go! And suddenly you're back down to 400, and you're like... And that's like awkward because <laughs> then it's like well now I don't have any goals in between 400 and 2000 and it's gonna be weird because then we have to hit the same goals again and you don't have to do that with recurring subs unless you have like a massive recurring sub apocalypse which probably won't happen unless you like say the n-word on stream or something so don't do that It'll happen when I stop playing Mega Man. So, I think that the recurring sub goal thing, it's really, really, really challenging to hit. Because, like, 
you, you'd be shocked at how low recurring subs are compared to like somebody's sub point count. You'd be shocked, I guarantee it. But they're goals that get met and they stay met, which is great. It makes me feel good. They used to do that, <clears throat> basic D's. They used to do that. It all depends. It all depends. Um, Cause if you have like event streams or something like that, where you get a big influx of sub points, then it can be like way, 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 way lower than 25 to 33%. Um, like the event that Tofu just had. Um, he said publicly on stream over and over again what his recurring sub count is, and it's like 800. 800, compare that to 13,500, you know? It's, it's, uh, it's brutal, dude. Yeah. about time. Okay. Sorry about the wait, guys. Um, I am a human with biological functions and I need to eat, so. <laughs> My bad. No more waiting. Only game playing. Let's do it. <laughs> uh, new game. Lies. Why does a robot need a cloak? It's been a year since Zero chose to take a different path from Seal. The very first sentence has dot dot dots. He still fights against Neo Arcadia, but these battles have lost meaning for him. Zero knows that to find his purpose, he should find Seal and the resistant soldiers. Da, da, da. It keeps his robot suit looking good? Okay. The sandstorm just stops as soon as they start following me. Prime Gaming. Mikhail, thanks for the three months of Twitch Prime. I hope this uh, Prime helps your recurring sub goals. It doesn't. <laughs> but I appreciate it. <laughs> Let's go, dot, dot, dot. <laughs> uh, okay, hang on. Main weapon, jump, dash, slash, and good to go. Uh, attack mode. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Anthony. So those guys just keep coming. Why I'm at full health? Why am I all tuckered out? Oh. Double kill, triple kill. <laughs> How is the volume, guys? I expect it to be the same. Oh no, not goddamn cyber elves. I expect it to be the same as yesterday. Good, fine, good. Good and fine.
I think I've said this on stream before, but the the max the sub points that we've ever had was around I want to say 4,400 something like that, um, and that was right after the Mammothon. So 4,400 sub points. Do any of you guys remember how many recurring subs we had at that time? Out of 4,400. Yeah, Brad remembers. It was right around 350. Right around 350 out of 4,400. That's crazy, isn't it? Bird is far more aggressive than he was in uh, zero one. I can't see if that's a pit or not. All right, thank you. Thanks, Lobo. It's just it, it's very very um slow going, you know. It's very slow going. I think people expect these like huge spurts in growth, but you know, it's just slow organic growth over time. And um, I'm super cool with that. I'm super duper cool with that. Another one of those things incoming? Nope. God damn it, I forget the timer every single time. <laughs> it's I would I I would notice if I had died. Guard Scorpion? Final Fantasy 7? Oh jeez. in these games <laughs> hey look at that supreme gunman let's go my first ever a somehow I did it dot 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 but it oh my god after every single word it cost me everything Dude, the sand is gonna get in his hair. You! Barb pathetic. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. Dot dot dot. <laughs> to live or perish. Hmm. Seal. There is so much a man can tell you, so much he can say. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thanks to your great efforts, it gives me great pleasure to announce the completion of this new resistance base. I thank you all for accepting me as the commander of this new base. I promise to bring about a new era of peace. Wait, that's a guy? Get the fuck out of here.
Victory! Or beast! Yeah! There she is! Alright. Ha ha ha! I'm still a little embarrassed when I think about being a commander. Are you sure about this? Trusting our fate to a reploid like me? Dot 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 question mark? Absolutely. It was you who organized us to fight against Neo Arcadia when we were barely able to escape from there. I'm flattered. But you helped me along. You know how unreliable I am without you, Seal. <laughs> you just keep in mind that we had to organize a resistance force in order to defend ourselves. Yes, I will remember that, and now we are buying time for you to complete your research. I, I hate this weird, inorganic way of shoving story into your face. I, I hate that shit. Yeah, yes. Ah! You have been streaming Mega Man for the last four weeks, Laser Belch, haven't you? Yeah. Yeah, I have. You're the streamer who wears the orange headband! Yeah. <laughs> Still, since X has not been resurrected yet, we couldn't ask for a better opportunity than now. Please allow me to carry out my operation. You're the one who cheats at every game he plays! <laughs> Alright. But promise me one thing, do not be too strict. You have my dot dot dot. Excuse me, sir. It's about Zero. He was found lying unconscious just outside the base. <gasps> what? Zero? This way. Zero! Zero! Dinkelberg. Seal's a guy too? There's no fucking way that Seal is a guy, okay? Zero! Then they just call... That, that's really common in the military. That's really common in the military to call females, sir. I'm glad you're alive, Zero. Zero, you're functional again. Yeah, exactly. You are in rough shape. I'm amazed you're still alive. They do it in Star Trek too. Welcome back. Where am I? You are in our new resistance base. Thanks to you, we were able to escape from Neo Arcadia and start a new life in this place. Thank you so much, dot dot dot, and I'm sorry, dot dot dot, <laughs> that we were unable to come rescue you. Come on, Seal. Zero must be very tired. I know you have lots to discuss with him, but why don't we let him rest for a bit? And Zero, I'm afraid that most of your weapons were broken, therefore I fixed them. I got fucking Metroided? I also created a new weapon, so why don't you come by later to pick it up? Okay, I'll go here. <coughs> I'll be in my lab for a while. Come talk to me when you're feeling better. I, they broke my rod! No! <laughs> I must be feeling better, because I mean, look at my fucking stance. You have recovered, Zero. You are known by all of our resistance soldiers, Zero. Well, except for the really new members who have just arrived here recently, Zero. So if you meet someone, please press up, Zero. And then you will talk with them, Zero. They will be glad to talk with you, Zero. I remember, Zero. <laughs> Seal and Servo are looking for you. Okay. Who the hell are you, anyway? My name is Alpizo. 
I have been appointed as commander of this new resistance base. I have heard a lot about you. Please lend your support to us. Let's fight together and destroy Neo Arcadia. Uh, okay. Mr. Totally Not the Bad Guy. Mr. Snivy, thanks for the gifts up to dot dot dot. Thank you very much. Thank you. <clears throat> destroy Neo Arcadia, huh? It's not that easy. Not gonna shake his hand? Leave him hanging? Wow. Then what are you gonna do? So that that's why he becomes a villain. It's because Zero left him hanging. I don't know. <laughs> ha 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 ha. You are a funny Reploid. Anyway, nice to meet you, Mr. Legend. He seems kind of sus. Uh, all right, back to the lab again. How are you doing, Zero? Honestly, how can you wear out your weapons like that? But don't worry, I've fixed them. I even created a new weapon called the Chain Rod for you. It is an outstanding weapon. Want instructions? Sure, teach me how to use my new rod. With the Chain Rod, you can hook and then hang on the ceiling or draw in an item. You can stab an enemy by holding the attack button as well as hitting an enemy normally. It's a useful weapon. You can also draw in an enemy once they are stabbed by pressing uh, the direction, okay? Why don't you try to hook the ceiling to hang? Okay, I'll get back to my research. Use it wisely. I got the shield boomerang. I, it won't let me use it? Hello? Let me make sure that my uh, controls are correct. Yep, it's triangle. Yep, triangle. Main weapon square, jump X, dash R1, sub weapon triangle, okay. Oh, okay, I gotcha. You piece of shit. Why would they want you to press both buttons? Okay. Oh wow, oh, oh, let's go, look at this. Oh yeah, I suppose the Game Boy has uh, only two face buttons, that makes sense. Okay, uh, Zero, are you okay? Uh-huh. That's good. I was so worried about you. We've been trying so hard to find you. I'm glad you found us. I found you? I came here before I lost consciousness? <laughs> Do you remember what I'm working on? I'm conducting research that will help develop a subsequent energy for energy crystals. It's a great invention that can drastically change the world. Change the world? Neo Arcadia began its iron-fisted policy because of the energy shortage. In order to protect the human society, Reploids were discriminated against, labeled inferior citizens, and were sent to concentration camps for retirement. History shows that an energy shortage in an era usually triggers a large-scale conflict. Once a substitute energy has been developed, the destructive conflict ends. When I told this story to the Commander El Pizzo, he laughed at it. He does say he will wait until I succeed in developing a subsequent energy, but in truth, El Pizzo believes defeating Neo Arcadia is the only way to regain peace. 
I have to finish this. I'll bring order to the world, not with destruction, but by the power of science. My research is almost done. I still need a little more information, though. Anyway, I'm going to manage your data for you. If you need me, come and talk to me anytime, okay? Save data now? Yeah, sure. All right. Hang on, I gotta see what the shield does. I had someone yesterday that was like, let me guess, he never used the shield, lol. The shield's in this game, you fucking idiot. There's not even a shield in the last game. Nah, it's in the first one too, you're wrong, okay? You're incorrect. So that's the Operation Righteous Strike. You just didn't get it? Okay, there you go. You can ride the mustache. You can't ride the mustache, it's gross. Uh, we are going to take advantage of the absence of X and thrust our forces upon Neo Arcadia. <laughs> you can Captain America and is broken. Victory is in your hands for a better tomorrow for all Reploids. For our future! Why, it's you, Zero. We are now preparing for an operation. Unlike the past minor scale ones, this operation will inflict a crushing blow to them. Once it succeeds, it will boost the morale of the resistance. Neo Arcadia is not a sitting duck. We should not carry out a frontal assault. We should gain time with guerrilla operations and wait for Seal to complete her research. Thank you for the advice. We are going to continue our guerrilla activities. We have gained strength and we are ready to work it out by ourselves. I'm sorry I was too harsh. Needless to say, we still appreciate your cooperation. Um, will you help now? Ha ha ha, don't worry. You've been a big help and we can't complain. Even if you refuse to help us now, just leave everything to me and you should rest for a while. We will destroy New York Arcadia by ourselves. Okay, see you later. Bye bye. If you want to go to the area that you have already cleared, please use the trans server. It is located at the center of the command room. It can transfer you to the other areas. In order to use the trans server, stand in the middle of it and speak to the operator. Sarah, I really wanted to see you. I asked you to stay with us. You lied to me, but I'll forgive you because you came back. Hey, all right. Where's the old man? You're new here. Welcome to our base, son. My name is Andrew. If you have time, come to my place. I'll tell you an interesting story. What's your name, young man? Zero. You have the same name as that legendary Reploid. Work hard and don't disgrace that hero's name. All right. Come to my place. I'll tell you an interesting story. Holy fuck, dude. Hey, just let me fight Chill Penguin. I don't need you to, like, explain everything to me all at once. Just let me fight Chill Penguin. Got an interesting story for you in my front pocket. <sighs> Bonk that man. Zero, you're safe. Yeah. Have I already been over here?
There's nothing in any of these goddamn rooms. Senior Spoon! Don't use those emotes for evil, you son of a bitch. This is the room that I started out in, right? Can I do that? I don't think I can. No. <laughs> the room room. You mislay the spire again? How did it go? Don't tell him, chat. Yeah, yeah, I'll help. Thank you. Now here are the current missions I'd like to ask of you. Look at the monitor, can you see them? They may not be enough of a challenge for a legendary hero, but it would be very appreciated if you helped us. <laughs> the computer zone. Train of N.A. Pan- Panther? Flow claws, Panther flow claws, Phoenix Magneon, Polar Cramoros, Heilig Orobacle. Polar, polar Camaraus. This mission is about sabotage. There is one of the computers in Antarctica which controls the defense system of Neo Arcadia. Once you destroy the Guardian boss and the computer room, the defense of the enemy stronghold will be weakened enough to carry out Operation Righteous Strike. Will you do this? Sure. Mission commencing. Everyone prepare for transfer. We are now ready to transfer. Transfer start. Good luck. Uh, there are four cooling systems for the computer room of the facility. Once you destroy all of the systems, the abilities of the computer room will be weakened. Hey, all right. Ooh. I... Why did you not dash? Oh, that's why. Gotcha. Hmm, okay. Suppose I have to do the weird download shit with the goddamn Cyber Elves. Didn't I get a cyber elf from one of you fuckers? I did. Cyber elf sounds like a fetish? Now, to me, it sounds more like a Yu-Gi-Oh card. But I suppose people can fetishize Yu-Gi-Oh cards. I've heard of weirder things. Whee! Caramba! Can't 
do that, huh? Not using the rod. I like the sword, man. Try hard enough, please. Wait, what? Okay, so those vents are ice vents. Interesting. You bitch, I didn't know you went that far. Z Saber skill, level up! Oh, I see. I see. Aha! I think that that was one of the things that I have to destroy. Okay. Perfectly missed time. Hmm. Okay, that does not work. Whatever. Yeah. I wonder if I missed some of them because I feel like, um... Is this the boss? Sub-boss? Mini-boss? Everything can be a kink, all you have to do is think. Uh, this this sounds like a good premise for a Dr. Seuss book when you put it like that. They found you! Are you okay? There, there were multiple people, and I think one of them was even a fucking news outlet that was, that was like... Think piece. Do you think that there should be age-appropriate porn? Which is just like... A media-friendly way to say, should we be making sexual content for children? And you're like... You could have just not said that, you know? You, you really... You, you could have just not said that. Yeah, I think it might have been the BBC. Sounds like you've got a... <laughs> not touching that one. <laughs> nope. Can I...? Hang on. That did not go anywhere near as far as I thought it would. Oh, 
pieces. All right. Okay. It's really gonna ask me to use this chain a lot, huh? Oh, that's just for... We, we don't need that. We're using cheats. So this ceiling, this ceiling is fine. No, it's not. The ice physics are real wonky. Okay, so on the ground, on the ground is uh, too low. Jumping all the way up is too high. So let's, the babyest jump of all time. That works. The babyest jump of all time. Functional. You got it. Can I just make this jump? I don't feel like I can. No, I definitely can't just make the jump. The ice physics just like eat your slide though. I would be slide jumping, but it just eats your slide. Breakfast, lunch, dinner, delicious slide. I think I only destroyed three of the computers. Whoa, you are the one. You are trying to destroy this and confuse us. What? Whoa. <laughs> I won't let you do that. Dude, he's got the Chad stride. Yikes. Oh, that stays. Okay. Oh, I can destroy just the uh, spikes. Okay. They're gonna do the thing again where you have to watch all the cutscenes repeatedly. That attack is a little ridiculous. Okay, so it looks like I should run up to that attack and smack it with my sword, I'm guessing. Yeah, okay. I think I understand.
He sounds like Shia LaBeouf. <laughs> Destroy it. Okay, I don't know what to do about that attack then, in that case. Shia LaBeouf? Is there, is there something that I have not heard? Does anyone run these games hitless? I have no idea. If you haven't seen it, Laser, Shia LaBeouf live Rob Cantor. I... what? Watch it, Laser, it's great. Yeah, maybe later. It's so great, Laser. I'm happy for you guys. Oh, come on, man. Dude. Man, that attack is fucking crazy to avoid. I can't, I uh, can't seem to avoid it. be a C student. I can't believe this. I was beaten by this little bug thing. <laughs> bo 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 fa. <laughs> what? All right, sluggish warrior. I got the ice chip. Uh, you captured the EX skill of Polar Cameras. You got the triple shot. A new form has awakened. The Rise form has become available. The fucking what now? <laughs> Mission accomplished. Transfer in progress. Two, one. Transfer complete. 
Well done. You're as amazing as I thought you'd be. I never doubted your success thanks to your cooperation. Our operations are progressing fine. You are such a great help to us. Um, you must be zero. My name is Doit. <laughs> okay. As Servo told me, you're so well designed that I can't believe you're an old type Reploid. I want to see your insides, so do you mind if I rip you apart? Ha ha ha, I'm kidding. Unless? No really, I'm just kidding. Don't look at me like that. What's up? Please tell me what you want to do. Just in case you forgot, the Cyber Ralph is a type of program which was created to support us. Usually you can use it after you download it, however, some of them can't be used unless they are bred. All, also, although we created them with our most cutting edge technology, a Cyber Elf cannot be resurrected, so please use each of them wisely. Okay, where am I downloading a Cyber Elf from anyway? Alright, that video is amazing. Ah, Zero, can you use your weapons? Well, by the way, I wanted to tell you one thing that I noticed while watching you. You seem to have a secret potential ability. For example, if you defeat a boss enemy with your level as high, you will learn how to use their ability. And if you use only busters, the attack power of the bullets will increase. If you defeat many enemies with the shield, your defense power will increase. Seems that there are more abilities inside you. It's really amazing. You are a Reploid that was created a long time ago, but you have such incredible abilities. Cyber Elf on a Cyber Shelf. Alright, hang on. Hey Zero, no one will believe me, but I'll tell you anyway. I saw green wind blow in the sky for a moment just when you were being carried here. Ha ha ha! Or maybe I was seeing an illusion. Ah, form! Normal, F. Rise, F. Triple, S. What? Equip ice chip, it splits into three bullets. That's cool, I guess. Uh, third slash moves upward. Two, 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 three. Okay, let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Operator. Wait, what? I just want to download a fucking Cyber Elf, asshole. We're never downloading a Cyber Elf. Okay, so who would be weak to ice? Let's see. Who would be weak to ice? Look through all of Seal's fucking options. What do I just have to talk to her? Yuck. All she wants to talk about is weird energy shit and dot dot dots. Train of NA. This mission I'd like you to see supplies. Currently, we are moving a large amount of troops, but we are a little short on supplies. Therefore, we are thinking about assaulting an enemy transport and seizing their supplies. Will you help? Yeah. Start! Okay. Good luck. 
All right. We confirmed that there are supplies in this transport train. Watch out for obstructions and seize the train. Okay. Ow. Ow! <laughs> what the fuck? They found you! So hang on. So I have to be moving forward for those things to show up. I gotcha. Fechner. I feel like that was the name of a boss from the last game. I don't remember. I played too many video games. Too many different ones on stream. Um, I actually... Have you guys seen, uh... One of, one of Barb's commands on stream is uh, exclamation point flex. Have you guys ever looked at that list? It's a list of all of the games that he has completed on stream. You guys know that he's beaten like 300 plus games on stream? gnarly. Uh, Mr. Zero, please listen. Enemy mechanoloids are approaching you. Their mission is to retrieve the supplies. Please protect the supplies and defeat the enemies. It's like a fucking Street Fighter game right here. Street Fighter mini game.
Their mission is not even to kill me and they're gonna kill me. Fuck! Dying to a single slash. Uh, okay. Do I get anything cool for that? I get the knowledge that I made a difference. Not even a Twitch Prime. Hey, you! Don't you know that this is Master Harpuya's territory? Huh? A minion of the Resistance Force? I shall stop you. Harpuya? Uh... Okay, so I actually I can't use anybody's weakness on them yet because I don't have anything fully upgraded. I can't like charge my sword. I can't charge up my buster all the way. Ow! Fucking dive kick? Oh, you're like way up in the earth. No wonder I can't hit you. Oh, cool. Oh, wait, this is his weakness. Oh, well, look at that. Bruh, how come every enemy's best attack is to just jump on top of your face? Every single enemy's best attack is just to exist inside of your hitbox. If I just put my hitbox into your hitbox, then I win. Pretty fucking cool move, bro. piece of shit Mega Man boss is like this. Every single Mega Man boss that is a big piece of shit does this exact thing. Every fucking one. It's, it's never like, oh, it's a really complex attack pattern. You really have to learn and use your brain. No, they just walk on top of you. And you're like, oh, okay, well, cool, I'm dead. This tiger guy is easy. You can't even identify what kind of cat he is. So, uh, pardon me if I don't believe that you know what you're fucking talking about. Uh, giant black cat. Uh, tiger. It's a labradoodle. Yeah.
It's just a really big house cat. Looks like a raccoon to you. I'm really, really disliking this boss right now, man. Like, he's just constantly off the fucking screen. He's either off the screen or on my face. There's like no in-betweens for this guy. Alright, pretty cool. Fun piece of shit. <laughs> he exists like exactly outside of my range. Yep. First playthrough. Is is that a uh, is that a question or? Oh, yo, yup, a question. Yeah, it's my first playthrough. This guy is a fat pain in the dick. What a miserable boss. <laughs> He's just always like just out of range or off the screen. No, that's that's really, really, really common for, for people to either like not see the title or not see info that's on screen. So usually I don't roast people for it, but every once in a while, if I'm in a roasting mood, you know. Every once in a while. <laughs> it took away my control. It didn't let me fucking jump anymore. It just didn't let me control myself. <laughs> it didn't let me control my character anymore. That's fucking bullshit. All right.
Get out of my face. All right. No, no, I can't believe. Master Harpuia, I am ashamed. I was not good enough. Gaha! H. <clears throat> Supreme Warrior, that sounds about right. Thunder Chip. I offer you this Bezos blood money. <laughs> Thanks, dude. Oh shit, I should be reading. Uh, you very much for your support, Zero. We appreciate your continued support. He's a Twitch streamer. Okay. Please tell me what you want to do. No! This is not what it did last time I asked about Cyber Elves. All she did was fucking tell me about it. Now I'm just like, whoa, here's the other options. Here you fucking go. Why didn't you do this last time? I literally already did this. I change bullets to vitality. Fine. Gaming. Genteel Cretan, thanks very much for the six months. Welcome back. I reduce a boss's energy. I am able to stun enemies. You'll never fall with me. Your enemy can't shake me, sticky. Okay. Uh, I don't really care about Cyber Elves. Don't really care. Next level. I'm gonna go with the, the snake. In this mission, I'd like you to rescue our comrades. There are ruins known as Dysis deep in the forest. Scout soldiers who went there in, to investigate have not returned yet. I'd like to send someone to rescue them, but considering our current state of preparing for the coming operations, we don't have a soldier available. I'm very sorry to bother you, but will you find and rescue them? Yeah, sure. Solid snack. We are now ready to transfer. Transfer start. Is this guy just pissing his pants? <gasps> Commander sent us here to investigate something called Baby Elf. But we encounter the Neo Arcadian army. My comrades are still somewhere in the forest. Please save them, Zero. I'm out of here. <laughs> the ruins are beyond this forest. Use the portable trans server and rescue the resistance soldiers who were lost. Okay. All right. So thunder. Okay. Beedrill. Who's that Pokemon? It's fucking dead. Are you fucking invincible? Really? Okay, well. How about that? Alright, so the purple ones explode. It's 
stage is kind of brutal. Skill grinds uh, and L slash crystal farm. Yeah, well, I mean, we're playing the um, we're playing the uh, collection version where we have like extra checkpoints and shit. Okay, hang on. Good, good, good. I'm glad. So hang on. That doesn't work, huh? Okay. Hmm, okay, how does that work? You remember this trash? Hmm. Can I? No, you can't, uh, you can't wall jump off of those. Okay, so I just had to go lower, looks like. So do all purple enemies explode? No. Okay. Thought maybe that guy was a different color. I felt that zero four was two Ez. Don't you hate that when a game is just two Ez? Hmm. When the game is to Ez, laser no dude. Okay. Ah, uh, whoops! Did not think that I was. Jeez! Oh, All right. This is the collection, yes. Ah, uh, okay. I thought he was gonna have much more health than that. Spikes, people clap. <laughs> you found a rare elf zero. Wow. I don't need this at all, but it's fine. <laughs> that felt pretty slick. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> overheat is definitely the correct emote for that. Hey, bud. Thank you. Be careful. Peace. Yeah. Thank you. I hope. Bye bye. Beach mouse. I definitely still don't understand the beach mouse thing.
Okay. Alabama Beach Mouse? Is there any other? Hmm. Charge Sword? No. Okay, see you later, dude. You're dead. So am I. <laughs> so many blind spikes. So many blind spikes. Sweet Home Alabama Beach Mouse. I wonder, actually, hang on. Dang. Okay. We can do that. We can totally do that. Got it. going forward and then I got off screen swamped. Glad that you came here to help me. Thank you so very much. Okay. Bye bye. You should have expected it, Laser. I know that you've never seen anything like that in these games yet, but you should have expected it. I should have. You're right. Can I just push these? No. Almost lost hope of a rescue. Yeah, well, one of your friends is fucking dead. <clears throat> Give that back, and your life may be spared his. What are you waiting for? Run! Hiss! This is a restricted area, even for us Neo-Arcadians. You will never leave here alive, Hiss. Snake man. Let me go! Let me go! I can't get out! Okay, he's not weak to lightning, unfortunately. So that means he was weak to fire, probably. What am I gonna get from this guy? <laughs> Isn't this incredible? <laughs> It's fine. This is fine. It's fine. I'm leaving you behind. You're fucking dead to me. I give a shit. Fuck this guy. I'm out. Peace. Peace, bitch. 
You should have been in a better spot to get saved. How'd he end up there anyway? Because he's a fucking idiot. The rod can pull down the box though. Dude, I already tried that though. If they wanted me to use the rod to pull down the box, they should have made it more intuitive because I already tried that. I literally already tried. I could have died right there. No, if only that baby elf wasn't stolen, I could have easily destroyed the nameless soldier. Hiss! Rod in the box. Come on. <laughs> Come on. B! Alright. Supreme Warrior. <gasps> X! It's been a long time, comrade. Krauser. I can no longer rest. Both baby elves have been awakened. The baby elves are still children. They cry for their mother as they tremble from the loneliness. Dot, 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 dot. What's your point? <laughs> The baby elves will do anything to reunite with their mother. Stir the humans' minds and bring chaos. It's all to meet their mother, the dark elf. The dark elf that I sealed. Wait, X. The dark elf. Is that an RE4 reference? Yes. <laughs> Mission complete. Ghost X is fucking useless. <laughs> yeah. Well done, Zero. You have been very helpful with your valuable cooperation. We've been able to retrieve another baby elf. We now have both baby elves in New Arcadia kept inside their vault once again. I'd like to thank you for your support. Okay. Phoenix Magneon. There's no way to exterminate all of Neo Arcadia. The rumor says that there is an arms factory in a city situated at 100 kilometers north of our resistance base. We found a power reactor supplying electricity to the factory close to there. If, there, if we destroy the power reactor, we would be able to limit their number of enemy soldiers. Will you do it? Yes. <laughs> this fight ain't bad. I don't know why, but having the villain talk to me in a single breath. <laughs> for some reason, I like that gimmick for this guy. All right. Destroy all power reactors to put a stop to the factory functions for good. Currently, there are four power reactors in operation. Villain spoilers? Uh, come on. Fucking look at him, dude. Are you serious? He's got some real boy named Sue vibes. Wait, I've been a guy this whole time? I'm turning, I'm turning heel for sure. They just announced a hard Mountain Dew. All right, how about that? Not even the most cursed thing that I've read today. Is that solid? It's not solid. Okay. Hmm. 
9% is pretty hard though. Oh, hello. The only market for that has to be gamers. What's down here? It's only 5% though? Well, then it's practically for babies. I thought that this was gonna be a man's drink. Why don't they just serve it in a bottle? A baby bottle? Does it come with a diaper too? Was it gonna make you shit yourself? Alright. Oh. This level is easy. Guys just respawning over and over again? I think that they might be. Uh, nope, they're not. Can't wait for Phoenix Guy, he's one of the worst bosses in the game. Uh huh. Wait, is this just the gold knife beam? Wait, what? It's just blatantly plagiarized? Ooh. Soften you up before the boss? That's fucked up. Okay. They soften you up before the boss. That's real fucked up. What are you doing here? How dare you fool around in my area? I am Phoenix Magneon. I'll make you pay for this insult. With my Phoenix Flame, I shall purify your evil mind with my flame. Ouch. Okay, does not... Actually, hang on. I, I have no idea if I hit him with uh, lightning or not there. Okay, so he really likes to do off-screen attacks. That's great. We appreciate that. We, have, we really appreciate off-screen attacks.
Yeah, dude, they just soften you up before the boss. That's fucked up. Man, this is the longest goddamn uh, intro. How am I even supposed to see that attack coming? Okay, so lightning is the weakness. That's good. Okay, you're just dodging, ev dodging everything. That's cool. Huh. Okay. You have to sense it with your gamer powers. Do I need fox ears for that by any chance? That's bullshit, man. Can you increase max HP in this game? Probably. They do help. Bullshit, man. Okay, so I was ready for it that time, but it was faster than I thought it was gonna be. The fuck is that shit, bro? All right. Hey, laser. I wanted to apologize for the bad joke yesterday. Oh, come on. If I time you out for ten minutes, it's a joke. I joked back at your joke. Was it was it a, a dumb pun dad joke? Absolutely. Did it deserve the timeout? Yes. <laughs> you don't have to apologize. Ah. Hmm. Uh, why does it uncharge me here? Was the joke so bad that Laser remembered it? How does a non-binary samurai destroy their enemies? They slash them. Okay, this is some bullshit. Okay. Oh! He's got a billion attacks. Give or take. One of those ghosts was vile. I really, I don't know what to do against this to not take damage. Ridiculous. There's no way that that's a dentist's favorite time of day. Did you guys know that, uh... It is not at all uncommon for, um... Dentists and vets to be, uh, depressed because people come to see them when they are uh, unhappy a lot of times, you know? Dentists and vets have very high uh, depression rates in their field. People come to see them for unhappy reasons so often. Okay. That's not a fun fact at all, but... It is a fact. Hmm. 
I go to my dentist to keep up my rad dental health. What the fuck? Gotta start high-fiving my dentist. What about postal workers? People don't hate to see postal workers, though. The dentist is a bit confusing. How often are people happy to see the dentist? <laughs> when when you have a profession where people fucking hate you, that doesn't uh, doesn't particularly sound like uh, something super happy, you know? Oh, I got him. Piece of shit. You enjoy going to the dentist? Chad? What? I feel like loads of people go to the dentist when they have a problem, not for proactive dental health too. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh my god. It's like my least favorite thing about Mega Man. I, I would no! Why did you face that direction, you dumb bitch? What the fuck was that? If you are taking damage and you release your charge, instead of releasing the charge, it just like drops it. As a cat doctor specialist, I often see cats with moral diseases. I can't imagine. That sounds terrible. But the happy visits are, you know, they're happy. Not like they don't exist. This is some horse shit. Man, this guy's attacks are really vicious to avoid. Really, really vicious to avoid some of these attacks. Okay. Like kittens? Hell yeah. Bio was at his best in X3. Vile was at his best in X8, obviously. Yeah. Fuck you, yeah. man. Are you fucking serious? I thought you were supposed to appear above my head for that attack. No, you can just appear at an angle and then fly a million miles? Oh my fucking god, dude. Okay, so underneath for the first volley is a free avoid. What do I even do about that? I forgot to charge. Oh wait, doesn't matter. It's fine. This plus the shitty retry system plus the shitty ranking system equals no god, please, no, no, no. Um, this save feature works. I should be using my, um... Fuck you, man. These attacks are ridiculous to avoid, bro! What do you do? I should just use my sub tank every time because it's just gonna refill every single time.
Muero. 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 I have no fucking idea how to avoid that. I have no fucking idea how to avoid that. Maybe I just jump into his face and take uh, contact damage instead of taking the full grab. I played this game, but I don't remember. It's because I'm playing the collection version. See, look. Save assist. It's basically so that I can make it a game that isn't miserable to stream. If I were playing it off stream, then maybe I would uh, have more honor, but on stream, I could not care less. Oh, I can just jump over his head? Okay. This is absurd, man. This is fucking ridiculous. Every Mega Man game of Watch you play looks miserable. There's always like one or two low points in each Mega Man game, but they're not miserable. I would certainly not call them miserable. Except for X6, that one was miserable. <sighs> this could be like the first boss that you fight. You could just pick this boss right off the bat without having their weakness and be like, oh, that, this is fun. Yeah, this is great. Yeah. I have no idea how to tell which one is the real one there. fucking hit him during. Phoenix, I will be back again and again until you pay for your insult. Uh, a woo! <laughs> yep, I agree. <laughs> Why do they all sound so stupid while they're dying? Alright, you got the flame chip. <laughs> Alright, transfer in progress. 
Transfer complete. Thank you very much, Zero. Another concern has been handled thanks to you and our operations are moving smoothly. I'm now very confident of our success. Yes, Mr. Nerd. Of course. Why wouldn't that be what it is? Okay, he didn't tell me anything new. Okay. What's up? Process my data. Save my data. Okay, let's see. Uh, what elves? I help in the fatal zone. I reduce a boss's energy. Could use that on like the last boss or something. Hmm. I help in the fatal zone. Yahoo! What, you look so sad now that you've eaten. I've, I've been there before though. Same. <laughs> I ate my food and now it's gone. No more food. Say fucking what? Didn't I just help you? Here, hang on. You're sad because you're an idiot scam artist. You fucking piece of shit. Have you ever cooked using tofu? I have not, no. We are ready to open fire, sir. We're waiting for the signal, sir. Well, the time has come to launch a massive attack against Neo Arcadia, or maybe it's best to say that it is time to destroy it once and for all. I'm happy to announce that we are commencing this operation right to strike. This has been a team effort, but I would especially like to thank the effort of the era. Let's begin, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> All right, wait. Why does that boss need to use a single breath? <laughs> what is it, Miss Seal? Is this necessary? Do we really have to do this? If we conduct an all-out attack, the casualties will be so high. I'm afraid that's the price we must pay for our future. It's sad. Okay. It's a show of strength. <laughs> Seal's research will be completed soon. Once the substitute energy has been developed, Neo Arcadia loses its reason to crack down on us. Will you give us a little more time? <sighs> that. Well, that's nothing but a sweet illusion. If a substitute energy is developed and if we give it to them for free, I don't think Neo Arcadia will show mercy to us. But, but. Silence. I apologize for my orders, Miss Seal, but you must follow them. I'm I'm so worried about you reploids, about Miss Seal, and about the resistance soldiers. I just want what is best for you all. 
All troops, open fire. Engage. All troops, open fire now. Roger. Seal, I wonder if she'll give you a kiss from a rose. We already made that joke. You're stealing my comedy. I'm going to the front line to give commands. Transfer me. Preparing to transfer. Don't worry, we can work this out later, and when this is over, I'd, I'd like to... Transfer commencing. Cheating by stealing lasers jokes. Shameless, I say. Zero, will you follow uh, Commander El Pizzo? Got a very bad feeling. Zero, please. Will you watch him? Yeah, sure. Thank you. Preparing to transfer. El Piso. You guys are very mature. Good luck. So we can like Wow. Okay. So I think that I wasn't able to do it before because I was in the air. Gotcha. Okay. Good to know. Okay. I'm always so worried that there's not going to be ground. <laughs> that there's just going to be an endless pit of spikes. And it's just like, well, you should have known, I guess, even though you can't see. guys will learn one day you guys will learn one day one day not this day but one day oh shit I was looking at a chat I can control Barb and Laser by telling them what to do, making them not do it. I can control you chatting in my stream ever again. See ya. Yeah, try it now. Shoot it in the head. Okay, so how do I avoid the spread? Okay, that one's easy to avoid. And this one's not easy to avoid. 
Not easy at all to avoid. Wow, okay. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it. Hey. <laughs> hmm, I actually have no idea how to avoid that attack. Just like a really precise little area that you have to be in. Okay. <clears throat> That's not good. Okay, so apparently they have weaknesses. Okay. Ice, okay. So, probably fire, I would imagine. Yikers! Okay, so let's try ice first. That's not. Okay. Ice. Busingly hard these games are. What's up, Lofist? That's fun, dude. Fighting the Regis from Pokemon. I can see it. Oh, that's all. Supreme Warrior. B rating. <laughs> that doesn't feel like a very supreme rating. You got a supreme B. Why are you so late, Zero? I was so bored that we had to retire all the resistance soldiers to pass the time. All that remains is only this inferior ex Neo Arcadia citizen. <laughs> Zero, I've been waiting for you too long. They were too weak to have fun with. Wanted to face you. Why don't we have fun together? Stop! What? Did you come to rescue this Reploid Zero? Yeah. <laughs> why do you- why do you bother? Even if you help him, he won't thank you. And if he lives, even more resistance soldiers are going to perish. I'll save this Reploid, and I won't let any more resistance soldiers perish. How greedy! But can you really do that by yourself? Emergency call for zero. An unidentified object is rapidly flying toward the resistance base. Return to base immediately. 
Oh, can you hear it? A bombardment aircraft is heading for your base with a special bomb. Using bombs is not my style, but all is fair in love and war. Your resistance forces have made a mistake that can't be forgiven. Neo Arcadia, or should I say human society, is not a thing that Reploids can rebel against. If they do, they should be exterminated. Operator, transfer us back to the base. Roger, transfer commencing. Zero. I don't think that justice is destroying resistance forces, but as long as they try to disobey humans, destroying them is my goal. Zero right now, pouty face. We have injured. Bring the emergency squad. Transfer in progress. Two, one. Transfer complete. Standby alert. The huge enemy aircraft is approaching. Estimated time of arrival is 10 minutes. Is it gonna give me a countdown? I'll take care of it. Ready, a shuttle. Roger, Zero is going to intercept it. Prepare an aircraft for launch. I'm coming with you, Zero. So they're good guys? It's a matter of perspective. I heard it is carrying a special bomb. I don't think you can just destroy it. You must neutralize it before you can destroy it. No, it's too dangerous. Zero, you can act brave, but you shouldn't be reckless. You know we have no other choice. Da da da. Da da da. Da da da. <laughs> Use a portable trans server. I'll let you know when. Yeah, yeah, let's see. We're leaving together, but still it's farewell. No, we can't approach any further or we will appear on their radar. Zero. Once you reach the enemy aircraft, please let me know by activating a portable trans server. Hmm. Ooh, this is a nice looking. Blind jump after blind jump, huh? <laughs> Let's go. Blind jumping is my favorite type of jumping. Oh, I thought that was solid. Okay, hey, all right. Dropping special bombs on my head. Alright, motherfucker, this time I've got full health. I'm gonna mess you up this time. Dude, there's a girl that I went to college with who was, uh, had a genuine phobia of ladybugs. What's that cool kid that's going, dude? I always thought that shit was crazy. That's when I learned that you can have a phobia of anything. I was like, damn, really? Ladybugs? got it from this game. That, that enemy killed her repeatedly. Hmm. I didn't even see that door. Didn't mean to do that. ay 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 If you die in Wisconsin, you respawn at the nearest Culver's. I thought you were going to say if you die in Wisconsin, you die in real life. I was going to say, D that's, that's true. <laughs> that's just true. Z-Saber skill up. You can now charge. 
your slash. I fucking told you guys I couldn't charge my slash with the weakness. Oh no, you told the camera. Uh, this was a mistake. No, it wasn't. I'm a genius. I didn't know. I regret my words and my deeds. How fast does that shit respawn, man? Really fast is the answer. Can I go this way? Well, great. Okay, I have made a tragic mistake. Oh, never mind. I'm the best. I'm not controlling this. I set the transfer coordinates. Uh, transfer seal here. You remain my power, my pleasure. Okay, I'll quickly release the bomb. The device is, it's here. I need 90 seconds to release the fuse. Please provide cover for me. <laughs> Please provide cover because there's gremlins incoming. They keep on spawning directly on her head. And you know what? I know that feel. I feel like a goddamn secret service agent diving in front of bullets for her. She can take more hits than you, Keck W. Yeah, you're right, she can. She should be the legendary hero. <laughs> Jesus, man. <laughs> that guy was diving right for her. Fuse has been released, all right. Uh, preparing to transfer. Secure your position. Mm. Whoa! <laughs> position secured. There's one guy just like... <laughs> uh, Seal, you go ahead. Alright, you follow me quickly. It's an emergency, Zero. Due to air turbulence, the transfer won't work. The storage of the aircraft is broken. Please escape from there. Good. Great. Wait, what? Oh, okay. It wasn't letting me go through the door. I was confused. Please jump off! Our aircraft is on standby and ready to pick you up. New cards obtained? Okay, so there's a boss? Who it is? Don't expect you can go back easily, Zero. I know you have released the bomb. However, 
we can still continue our mission if I have the aircraft crash into your base. I am Kuagust. Kuagust Ankus. He must have been from the first game. We will become a flaming arrow and crash into your base. Kuagus Ankus. So last game there was a... Okay. <laughs> cool. Last game there was one of these guys and he was weak to ice. You're just gonna, uh, I'm gonna keep doing it over and over again until I get you. Well, it worked, didn't it? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Okay. My name is Fungus Among Us. I am your doom. I failed to avenge you! <laughs> okay. Lightning Warrior. <laughs> Zero. Seal, thanks for intercepting the aircraft. Yarp. Where's Commander Alpizo? Commander Elpizo has assigned Seal as the acting commander and took to the field. His current location is unknown. I will play the message he left behind. Listen. <sighs> Miss Seal, our operation has failed. You can blame my foolishness. Haha, ha, I'm such a fool. I was an errand boy in New Arcadia when I came here. They assigned me as a commander and I failed everyone. I was such a fool. This is all because I didn't have the power. I want to be strong, I want to be all-powerful, I want to be most powerful Reploid ever, I'll destroy New York, Arcadia and all the humans, then I'll be the true hero. Why does he talk like that? We may be able to track down the history of, Z of <laughs> Trans Server that El Pizzo used. Here they are. The commander must be in one of these locations. Will you follow? Locate and bring back the commander. We must. We must help El Pizzo. What, are you gonna give me four new missions, or...? Let's process some data. I have no idea how many- you piece of shit. Oh thanks, oh I only need 140 more, I can totally- okay. Wow, it really is. It's giving me four more missions. Holy shit. All right, I'll bet that El Pizzo is in one of these areas. Um, let's just go in order. I already have weaknesses for everybody, I'm pretty sure. I've got fire, ice, and lightning, so fuck it. I didn't see what his name was. <laughs> this must be the ruins of the lost civilization which Neo Arcadia has been administrating. This area is considered to be the forbidden land where even the Neo Arcadian citizens are not allowed to enter. I don't understand why El Pizzo went there. Will you go there? Sure. Those later three are from the first game. Yeah, I recognize them. We already saw them, actually. They they mocked me and sold, told me, Special Bomb. <laughs> 
Wait, yeah, the ninja guy. Where'd the ninja guy go? Did he quit the team? Did he get kicked out? <laughs> Everyone, prepare for the transfer. He dead. <laughs> I like that theory. Oh, he actually died? Yeah, I know he exploded, but if so did Zero, like, fucking 18 times. Ha ha ha, Zero, nice to see you again. Are you looking for me? Return to the base. What can you do by yourself? Dot, 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 question mark. Actually, I can do anything and everything if I obtain a certain thing. I learned something about uh, that makes invincible once you obtain it. Thank you to the baby elf. <laughs> you mean the dark elf. <laughs> Yes, he, 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 I once thought something from mythology. I was wrong. I have come to believe <laughs> that he's on the last seal of dark elves somewhere around here. Let's find who will find it first. Okay. <laughs> he, he, he. All right. You found El Pizzo. Zero. Take care of him, please. You want me to kill him? I'll do it. Wait, is this a fucking area that I've already been? Caterpie? That's blatantly Caterpie. Hello? And, and, like, I already said that that was Beedrill, so I, I guess we're just in a Pokemon area. This is the Safari Zone, confirmed. Uh, okay. Okay. Nice desync, yeah, I know. I have to do this idiot shit again. Man. Legally distinct insect. Give me back my sword. Okay. <laughs> I tried to wall jump and I just walked into the wall. Wait a minute. You just destroy these, huh? Song's kind of a banger. Isn't this the song that got, like, we, we replayed this song a thousand times in the level that I died in over and over again? Pretty sure. And, and chat was like, the music! Beach Mouse, Beach Beach Mouse! Make game or something? I've never heard of it. No, this is a real game. It was a Game Boy Advance game. So uh, maybe you just weren't a big handheld guy. My sword isn't maxed out yet. I actually didn't want to do that. Hmm. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> All right. Next time, let's only destroy the top one. How about that? That'll be better.
you have to like actually press the direction that you want to pull it. It doesn't just automatically pull it. That's weird. Legacy of Goku? I never played any of those games when I was a kid. I, I played a shitload of Game Boy Advance, but um, I think that it was mostly I played like a select few games, like hundreds of hours as a kid. Golden Sun? Oh yeah, absolutely. Lots and lots and lots of Golden Sun. Can I please? Can I please? Please can I? Oh, that's an E-Tag. This looks like a mistake. There we go. Hell yeah, brother. Did I put my sword back on? I did. I got jizz down. Oh my god, okay. I was covered in the goo. Sub tanks instead of feeding elves in this game. <laughs> yeah, definitely prefer the sub tanks as well, especially since the uh, the elves are all such gluttonous whores. They they take such an unbelievable amount of feed. Uh, what would a frog be weak to? Let's let's use ice. But then again. What happens to a frog when it gets struck by lightning? Uh, he he he. Finally, I found the key. Nice try, Zero. He he he. Well, wait! Wait, wait, wait. No one can go beyond here, Ribbed. This is an order of Master Harpuia, Ribbed. Dot 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 question mark. Hmm. Is there someone on the other side of the door? Ribbed? No way. This must be a false alarm. I need to have my sensor replaced. It ain't nice. No laughing, Flaming. Oh. He summoned Caterpies, and they made him stronger, okay? Mmm, it did a lot of damage, but it didn't make him, like, react. Let me try fire, I guess. Oh! What is one of those weird situations where it was lightning, but it's only with, uh, like, the sword? I'll try this again.
Mm, no. Hmm, weird. So first, what the fuck? <laughs> Looks like Politoed. Maybe like a really evil Politoed. And that dealt pretty good damage. Sure. Did laser win as earlier as slay the spire run? Why are you guys why are you guys so mean? <laughs> Man. <laughs> that fucking donation that we got earlier. <laughs> That fucking donation earlier killed me, man. God. <laughs> after after I won that run, somebody donated with a TTS message that said, Wow, good job, Laser. I can only imagine how many hours this took Melo. <laughs> <laughs> that, was, that was a good one. That got me pretty good. Oh, oh, Chonker! That's tight. <laughs> Outplayed. Yo. All right. Uh. <laughs> so I'm thinking that you don't want to let him do that. Yeah, I think that you might be onto something with that. Let's just not let him eat any more of the uh, yellow ones. It's like Mario Party. The the gold one is worth more points. Okay. I'm kind of getting my my ass kicked by this guy. Piece of shit. Um, Uga! Master Harpuya! How can I apologize to Master Harpuya? That, that, that question mark. Ugh, Gwa! <clears throat> okay. Supreme Warrior, that's right. That's right. <laughs> Gah ha ha ha! Now all I have to do is break the seal of the Dark Elf, then I will be as strong as you, Zero, or should I say stronger than you? Dot 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 question mark. Oh, don't get me wrong, I won't use this power for evil. I do this for world peace and for Miss Seal. <laughs> me, me, me. <laughs> Uh, okay. Sorry, Zero. I didn't expect them to become that strong. X. As long as I'm protecting the seal of the main body, I'm not ready to deal with them. Don't worry, I'll handle it. She is responding to her children. Zero, we have no time. You must find a way to stop El Pizzo. 
That dude's just simping hard for Seal. The Dark Elf. Mission accomplished, transfer me back. Me, 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 me. Prime Gaming. <sighs> uh, professional Master Vader, thanks for that brand new Twitch Prime sub. I appreciate that. Enjoy your emotes. All right, transfer in progress. We are on our way back. El Piso? Thank yeah. You. The Dark Elf, a key to unlock the seal, invincible power. I'm not sure what's El Piso up to. I believe it's wrong to bring peace to the... Wow. <laughs> hmm. She's the next boss. Hmm. <laughs> With power. Oh. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> please, Zero, please stop him. <laughs> oh. food motherfucker all right I help in the fatal zone I don't know what that means but I'm excited to find out I can boost your vitality okay all right zero out of 999 yep Okay, uh, Fairy Leviathan. This is Neo Arcadia's computer facility in Antarctica. You have destroyed most of it, but some of the systems are still alive. El Piso seems to be trying to find out the secret code to go into the facilities in Neo Arcadia. I wonder if he intends to break into Neo Arcadia alone. Do you go there? Yarp. Cool. Uh, McKillen, thanks for the 17 months. Welcome back. Thank you. I wish you good luck. Zero, can you hear me? It seems you can't enter it through the facility. You need to enter from the outside. Stay alert. Oh, those are mines. Okay. Listen to me. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I thought that I could be slick. Layer is best wife. You guys just like layers under boob. Is this game good? Yeah, it's good. It's a little frustrating. But it's good. Beef fire? <laughs> beef fire, I'm guessing, right? Beef. Beef fire. I like it.
You say that as if you don't agree. I didn't even notice the underboob until like several hours into the game, y'all. Didn't even notice. I am innocent of all, uh, all transgressions here. Yep, I am innocent of all horny transgressions. Damn. Hello, Zero. It's nice to see you again. I'd love to play with you, but unfortunately, I have no time. As soon as I defeat you, I have to take care of Commander El Pizzo. So let's go, Zero. Wonder if she has different attacks. That's, uh, is that a Nopers? That's a Yepers. <laughs> yep, she's got new attacks. Is anyone here truly innocent of horny transgressions? Only the ones that I'm being accused of right now. you El Pizzo went somewhere I got caught up in the fun of the moment how foolish of me your strength drives me crazy next time I'll do better so see you again lightning warrior so this is Vaporeon but looks like Glaceon Passy. I forgot about that. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, oh shit, I'm, sp I'm skipping it all. <laughs> Highest security area in Neo Arcadia, I guess the Dark Elf is sealed there. Okay. My bad. Let's see, process Cyber Elf, Feed Elf. You gluttonous bitch. Alright. Alright, this is where, uh, this is the crystal cave where the bombardment aircraft that we destroyed is crashed. Albizo seems to have been there to look for something, but I don't know what it is. Since the area is very close to our base, I asked some resistance soldiers to look for Alpizo. I don't know if they can manage by themselves. Will you help them? They, they definitely can't manage by themselves. Do not search Leviathan Rule 34. I feel like you might find the Final Fantasy Summon. Alright, this should be the meeting spot for our comrades. It's strange, no one has arrived. Zero. I've got a very bad feeling. What's up, Dewashi? Dude, these enemies are so irritating. They, they just, they, there's no fucking, you just have to know that they're coming. Just know that they're gonna be there, man. Come on. It's not that hard. This better be worth it.
It's probably not, Keglio. Yeah, yeah, I know. The, ju the last jump is gnarly. <sighs> getting it over, getting over it ass jump, I know. Why? Why? <laughs> I actually don't know if this is possible. So the reason that I'm able to make this jump is because it slides down one more tile. Hmm. Alright. See you later. Not worth it. I don't give a fuck. Laser, you're not getting past you now, dude. Now he's never going to get passy. Yep, I hate this. Sure, whatever. All right. Just go, just go, just go, yep. Passy, that was the name of the character that like sacrificed themselves so that Zero could be reborn. It was, uh, silly. Oh, okay. Really, really like this. Really, really enjoying this. <laughs> enjoying this a lot. Just love the riff. Yeah, me too. Yeah, me too. You're sipping like I don't know what to do. I know what to do. It's just slow and boring and I hate it. Fuck! 
fucking Jesus. He didn't notice. <laughs> All right, let's fucking do it. Fine, fine, I'll do it. Uh, yep, this is fun. Very enjoyable segment. Just fucking go away, please! You don't know say. It's almost like that's exactly what I said. I know what I'm doing, but it's slow and terrible, and I don't like it. Oh, good! Uh, are you serious? Leap of faith now, huh? Yep, leap of faith. Woo! Yeah! Leap of faith! Let's fucking go, boys! How many games huge. left in the marathon? Your meat is massive. I know everybody loves you. Juan Pequeño. <laughs> Thanks for the tier 3. 33 months. You madman. I appreciate that uh, big dick support. This where the leap of faith was. Thanks, Juan. Hope you're doing well, dude. That was good to see you. This was where the leap of faith was. I don't know what color the leap of faith pillar is gonna be. But it's like right here. Okay. Pretty cool video game. Pretty fucking cool. Another one, huh? Another leap of faith. Why? I gotta say, that section was pretty cool and well designed, actually, now that I'm done with it. I really enjoyed it. <laughs> Zero, they're being controlled by something. Make sure you don't harm them, Zero. Oh, I won't. Alright, I'll let him live. To go. 
even further beyond! Uh, Natty Light, thank you very much for the Super Saiyan 3 years, bud. Thank you very much. I really appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. It's a really, really long time to stick around with my stupid ass stream. Thank you. Laser, uh, today I started playing Curse of the Dead Gods, thanks to you. Cool game. Hell yeah, dude. Are you saying buh as you open all the doors? Buh! I almost fucking chopped your head off, man. When I hit three years, I wanted to be the ASMR version. Three more months, huh? Foo foo, this is it. Now I am a step closer to the dark elf. Foo foo foo. <laughs> that commander of yours seems to have retrieved the uh, IFF beacon. I wonder what he is up to. Why is he acting alone, breaking into Neo Arcadian facilities? I don't understand the logic at all. Well, I don't really need to know. All those inferior resistance behaviors are not all that different. Well, Zero, it's time for you to meet your end. Yeah, you have new weapons. I'm wrong. You don't. At all. So, you are partial to fire. Okay, you have new attacks, though. Are you serious? How can a legend end? What? You killed me. When this, mar when this marathon will end, didn't you suffer enough? It'll never end. What? Oh, all right. I didn't realize that it was weak to ice. Ow. Okay. Let me go! Aww. Yes, finish Mega Man ZX, then Battle Network, then Star Force. Absolutely not. None of that. Whatever, whatever weird bullshit you just said. That was cool. Yeah, that was cool. Then he has to play Mega Man fan games? Uh, no. No, I, I just certainly do not have to do that.
Excellent band, sir. Exquisite joke. Just joking about, but if it's too far, oh well, it was fun, my guy. What? Can't you guys just, like, I don't know. What? Can't, can't you just say I won't be a fucking dumb asshole in the future? Can't you just say that? Can't you just say, hey, my bad. I won't be a dumb asshole in the future. Can't you just say that? No, 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 no. Wait a minute. Oh, no, no, never mind. That's... How can a laser end? Damn it. frames during that. I thought I was being slick. Oh well. Ha ha ha. You are still so strong. I like it. No, I love it this way. You are the only one who can make me feel this alive. I enjoy the sensation. I love the pain. You are worthy. I feel the same way, Zero. <laughs> Mission accomplished. Transfer me back. Sluggish warrior. Fuck you. He still gave me a B. That guy needed horny gel. The IFF beacon that El Pizo was looking for is used for Neo Arcadia radar to identify friend or enemy. I know you need one when you want to sneak into an enemy base without letting them notice you, but I don't understand why he's trying to do that. She loves Zero Saber. Um, listen, Zen Warrior, I need to stop you there. I know that that was obviously someone that looked very feminine and may have even been voiced by a woman, but that was a guy. I was informed of that yesterday when I made the same mistake and I was mocked mercilessly. Download L. Okay. Yeah, all right. Let's save. He loves your said There you go. That's the point. So a redundant factory, but I guess they reconstructed it and it was working on a small scale. Why this place anyway? What did El Pisa go to this factory for? I don't understand. Still, one thing I'm certain is that it's too dangerous to act alone. Please stop him. Everyone prepare for the transfer. We are now ready to transfer. Dot, 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 dot. Thank Please stop him, yeppers. Zero, stay alert. Okay. Whoop.
Not looking too alert right there, Zero. You're getting shot in the face fucking repeatedly. Okay. Straight name Danny. Thanks for the gifts of two LPs. That was a great. Hey, thanks. Ow. Oh, you give me the health. Thanks, Street Name Danny. I'm sure that that's a real account. That really watches. Okay, wow. Pretty surprised we made it through that without dying. Yeah, okay. That's fine. That's fine. Yikers. <laughs> that was pretty good. Not good enough, though. Okay. See you later, Cyber Elf. Smell you later, nerd. Okay. sad. Okay, that's fine. Because <laughs> we got the checkpoint. That's fine. Yeah, what did I even get hit by? Okay, I gotcha. Uh, I mean, fuck that, I guess. That was pointless. Oh, that's a new attack. We're even hiding that one, man. God damn it is electricity. Oh, you must be zero. I haven't already kicked your ass repeatedly. I'm so glad to see you again. I was chasing a guy named El Pizzo. You know him, right? Ha ha! I am lucky to meet you here. Now let's start. Let's do it now. Here I go! That was really fun. Thank you, Zero. I enjoy a challenging fight like this one, hee hee. 
Next time, let's go for even more. See ya. Okay. Yeah, knew I would too. That's why I was talking so much shit. Transfer complete. He seems to have stolen a transport from the factory. It's true that you can't travel to Neo Arcadia by a portable trans server, but El Pizzo does intend to sneak into Neo Arcadia alone. <laughs> you couldn't stop me, Mr. Zero. Transmission through a secret line. According to the ID signal, it's Commander El Pizzo. No way. Switch it to the main monitor. Guess where I am, Mr. Zero. Surprise, surprise, I'm in the deepest core of New York Arcadia. I'm in the room where the Dark Elf is resting. It's, it's, it's This is where even high executives are prohibited to enter. Hee hee hee. First, I'll awaken the Dark Elf. Next, I'll destroy the original X. Then I will be able to obtain the true power of the Dark Elf. Hee hee, I'm going. I'm going to gain the ultimate power. Okay. Um? It's you, X. I'm not afraid of you. You can't move while you are sealing the Dark Elf. You better take care of the baby elves. What? What are you doing? No, stop! Step, bro! Don't bother! <laughs> what? <laughs> hey, don't go, baby elf! I won't! Give in! Arrgh! What just happened to him? It's not safe for work, don't worry about it. What was that? I just, you don't wanna know, okay? Who would have guessed that Alpizo was a villain? At last, he has made his way to the sacred vault of Neo Arcadia. Worse, he has damaged the seal of her, the Dark Elf. I'm sorry. My voice couldn't seem to draw off his attention, but she. They call her a Dark Elf. She is not fully awake yet. With my remaining power, I'm still trying not to wake her up. Please, Zero, come to Neo Arcadia, and please stop him, Zero. I can't tell if he's a villain or a complete moron. Yeah. Seal, trans me now. We can't transfer you directly to the core of Neo Arcadia. But if you go, we can transfer you to somewhere around the main entrance, though it's very dangerous. But, Zero, don't worry. I'm sure I can work it out. Dude, he's got that anime hair on point. Look at that shit. Zero, da, 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 da. I don't even know if I'm going the right way. I feel like I have to be. What's up, Desert? You know it's serious when you see that many dots. No! <gasps> Fuck!
Seems a lot easier this time around, actually. That attack is still bullshit, but it's a lot less bullshit. Yeah, that attack is definitely still bullshit, but a lot less bullshit. They read my hate mail. Would you fucking kindly? He's definitely way easier in this game than he was in the last one. I've set a coordinate axis. Now you can return here anytime you want, so please return to the base once before you go any further. Please, Zero. Okay. Lightning Warrior. Transfer in progress. Thank you. It's the end of the world, why would you uh, pause to stop home uh, to drink my chocolate Ovaltine? Zero, I'm glad you're safe. For your effort, please just rest for a while. No? I mean, I'll save, but... Uh, it's the Temple of Flame, are you sure? Yup. May I bother you to die just one more time? Nope, we're not gonna die for the rest of the game now. Uh, I take back everything I said. I'm just gonna let them, yeah, kamikaze into me. I don't even care. Just, just blow it up, man. I don't fucking care. There we go. Fuck yeah, brother. Hey, no need to get mad, okay? 
just uh, play video games with as massive a brain as as I have. Okay. What's happening here? Why did you pause so long? You're gonna uh, j just show me the fucking lava that's coming up toward me. Don't let me do anything about it, but. No dough, but. God damn it. Hey, Zero, you came along to get LPs out? I knew you did. Uh, he is crazy about the Dark Elf. Leave that guy to Harpuya and have fun with me instead. I ah! <laughs> Get ready for a fight, brother. Are you still weak to... Lightning? Yep. Sure are. Damn it. Da -da 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 dun 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 Supreme Edge! <laughs> Sorry guys, my hair isn't long enough for Supreme Edge right now. <laughs> I said put it over one eye. <laughs> What's the problem? Even though I had powered up, I'm no match for you. I, I won't give up. Someday, I will destroy you for sure. Just you wait. Copium. Set a coordinate access. Now you can return here anytime you want, so please return to the base. Please, Zero. Zero is returning. Transfer in progress. Have you guys ever seen that picture? Um, it's a picture of... Like, a whole bunch of superheroes, Marvel and DC superheroes. They're lining the halls, and they're all bowing, and uh, doctors are walking down the hall. And people have memed that one to fucking death. People have taken that photo and memed it to death. Here, hang on a second. Here, hang on. Um... Yeah, yeah, it's because of COVID stuff. Yeah, so here's here's the picture. But um <laughs> people have taken obviously this picture and replaced the doctors with like whoever they want. And the worst one I've seen so far for sure was Shadow the Hedgehog. <laughs> it's just walking down the hallway and all the superheroes are like <laughs> It's the goddamn worst. It's fucking terrible. Woof. <laughs> you mean best. No way. Uh, don't take it too far. Thanks for your efforts. If something should happen to you, I... Like Manhattan would give a shit. You are about to go to the second area of New Arcadia is the Temple of Ice. And can you do it? Yep. Zero is going to take to the field. Everyone prepare to transfer. Yeah, Dr. Manhattan could just poof COVID out of existence. He could, he's literally the only one there that uh, would not give a single fuck about disease. 
But he wouldn't because he's a dick. Yeah. <laughs> True. A big blue swinging dick. <laughs> yep. Fine, fucking 69 deaths. Grab the ladder, you dumb shit. If you die again, I'm leaving. What if I die again and then just don't raise the counter? That would be dishonest, sir. plus one. It worked. That's why we're mad. <laughs> foo foo. I'm waiting for you, Zero. I guess Fepnir's disease infected me. Once I start thinking of you, I stop caring about the Dark Elf. Even if the world is destroyed, I will be happy as long as I can defeat you. Now, let's battle. Let's Kung Fu fight. Type. Whoa! All right. Oh Jesus! <laughs> Holy fucking shit! <laughs> all right. Uh, all right. Well, so long. Uh, Sixty-nine deaths. So long. Sixty-nine deaths. So long, dental plan. <laughs> <laughs> Lisa needs braces. Dental plan. Hmm. The hell did she call me? Ah, uh, this boss is bonkers. Boss is bonkers. <laughs> Fuck you. Did she say wait in Japanese? Mate? 
They, they speak Japanese all the time. She does not fuck around, no kidding. I just got Mario Maker to do. I remember the Mega Man X6 boss that was like, Mate! So, go, go. Go to bed! that I had at that time. Okay, all right. Yeah, 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 and then the other famous Japanese line. I will crush you. I will beat you. Ha, ha, ha. I'm getting worse than ever. The only thing I can take seriously is fighting with you, but I'm happy. I'll keep going, dreaming that I can destroy you someday. See you soon. It's a really cool boss fight. I actually like that one a lot, yeah. I set a coordinate axis, and now you can return here anytime you want. So please return to the base, please. Sarah, please. Why is she getting all weird on me, dude? Do you... Okay, so something that I really like about these games is when you use weaknesses on the enemies, you do like a really satisfying amount of damage to them. Uh, I'm sorry that I asked you to risk your life. Why, what else is new? <laughs> All right, you are about to go to the third area of Neo Arcadia. It's the Temple of Wind. This is the last area before the capital, Arcadia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Want to go there? Yeah, 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 yeah. Zero is going to take the field. Everyone prepare to transfer. Yeah, the weaknesses do actually slap. And it's not just here's iframes. Ha, ha, ha. XD, Limo. Please don't overstrain yourself, dot, dot, dot. Why is she being so fucking weird all of a sudden, man? No, 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 it's it's ice for this dude. This is, this is the guy that got like sexual gratification from fighting me last time, so I'm really not looking forward to fighting them again. They're weirding me out. Well... We do have a rod, but it's a floppy rod. Like, like, look. Look at my big floppy rod. At least it's big. God damn it. Oh, I got gotcha. you. 
and the shield that will not see use. It's in the first game, dude. The shield is, is in the fucking first game, man. What are you talking about? Oh, hello. Hello, hello! Let me up, okay. Fucking piece of shit. No, 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 no! Okay. like a lot of health from the pickups which is really really nice that feels good man even the small health pickups feel substantial whereas like in regular Mega Man X you get a small health up and it's like, like thank you really that's great you gave me the tiniest amount of health I've ever seen in my fucking life Harpooia ha 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 you've made it here at last zero Look, this is Dark Elf, a perfect cyber elf which will bring peace to this world. <laughs> Excellent, I skipped it. All the humans who waste their valuable energy and destroy Neo Arcadia, which protects them. All I have to do is destroy X, who has been interfering with the true revival of the Dark Elf. Man. I won't let that happen. You, you can still say such a thing? Be a good boy and sleep. Wahahaha. <laughs> you must know your own worth. Do you regret that you haven't shown any respect for me? Now that I am so much more than you, I have acquired a power no one can match. I am become invincible. <laughs> he he. It's getting late. Time to wake the dark elf up. Let's celebrate the new history of the new world. Why don't you enjoy yourselves? Well then, enjoy. What? I have to watch this cutscene every time I die. I better just not die. Ugh. Z zero. Finish me. Just finish me. I will soon be controlled by baby elf. Finish me now and stop him. <laughs> just don't die. People blanket cutscene time.
<laughs> Hang on. <laughs> that just seems like that. I mean, it makes sense when you play the game. Okay, no, I hear it now. <laughs> <laughs> Finish me! Finish me! Mode 7. Omega symbol on the life bars, uh, they are Omega bitches, and they know it. That's why they keep getting their asses kicked. Hurry, Zero, protect Master X and the world from him. I understand. Leave it to me. I've set a coordinate axis. Now you can return here anytime you want. So please return to the base, please, Zero. I'm telling you, she's being weird. <laughs> I don't know. Why? Why does she keep on talking to me like I'm, I, I, like I'm on death's door right now? Like, do you see my fucking combat stance, woman? I'm ready to go. Zero, I'm so very worried about you. Soon you'll be able to reach the deepest part of Neo Arcadia where the dark elf is sealed. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She wants to sniff my hair. Damn it. <laughs> There's a final area of New York Kitty where you go. Alright, I'm going, I'm going. Painful. <laughs> this is actually painful. <laughs> Please don't restrain yourself, Zero. <laughs> oh my god. Ah, uh, let's see. I, I feel like this is- oh, that's a ladder. I thought that was a wall. I feel like this is gonna be the final, uh, boss rush and shit. You guys- you guys ready for a good old-fashioned, uh, boss rush? Good old fashioned Mega Band boss rush. Whoa, what are you doing? Okay, there you go. And there it is. And there it is. And there it is. Here we go. Oh, you have to press up to, uh, to do it. Remember you, Whoa! Master El Pizo, Master Dark Elf. The new world, it's ready. Damn you! Okay. The Chad Stride. I forgot all about it. The goddamn Chad Stride. Where's El Piso? What? What am I doing? So hot. Whoa! <laughs> nice strat. Hey, thanks. It was a pretty good one, huh? Mm. 
No! Okay, it was electricity. Forgot about this idiot. <sighs> Alright, see if I remember how to fight you. With the combination of Master Ellipso, or Elpizo, I mean, and Master Dark Elf, the new world is ready to begin. I don't know how to tell which is which. Damn it. Yeah, I forgot you have to go over that attack. Man, this boss is fucking hard. The new world, the new order, the new peace, Master El Pizo forever. Nice strat laser. <laughs> there, I forgot to count that up. Oh man. This boss is fucked, man. This boss is super fucked. Man. Man. You're fucking kidding me! I was in my iframes and you can still hit me? You guys think that I cheat? Holy shit! I was just guessing because it was there over and over again. <laughs> All right. Ugh, it can't be. I didn't think my heart could be tricked by them. Foolish. Because you do cheat. Um... Did I ever find this guy's weakness last time? Master El Pizzo and Master Dark Elf, the new world is ready to start. I don't even know if I used this guy's weakness on him last time. You fucking piece of shit. Let me go, man! Let me go! God damn it. <laughs> ah! Isn't this incredible? I don't even know if that's his weakness. Got killed by a slinky, yeah, I did. Uh, did I use fire last time? I don't even remember. Maybe this is one of those neutral guys that just doesn't have a weakness. Yeah, I think he is. Mm 
Neutral, no weakness, man. Fucking what? Okay. Where am I? Alpizo came and baby elf came. What am I doing? His Feels no weakness, man. You guys are gross, you know that? Yup! <laughs> All right. Give me more bosses. I want to kick the frog's ass again. All right. Who we got here? The two of them, the greatest thing ever, is ready to awaken. Another chapter in our glorious history begins. Master Alpizo forever. Let's go, little brother. Yes, brother. Let's go, brother. Oh, shit. Oh, double shit. Oh, triple shit. History is about to be written, Master El Pizzo forever, and the bond between the Ancus brothers shall live forever. This is getting out of hand. Now there are two of them. Okay. <sighs> New boss in the middle of a potentially final stage. Okay, so I'm gonna try to shoot him, I guess. Actually, can I jump out of his little tornado grab thing? Let me try that. If, if I can just jump out of it. Like, laser, you're just in the tornado. Get out of the tornado. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. <laughs> Yeah, I guess. Yeah. <laughs> wow, he's so smart. That guy is just Peebo juicing in the background. You see him? Oh my god. I didn't realize. Why wouldn't you? You should be dead. <laughs> what? What happened? Brother! It can't be. We were manipulated. Ugh! All right. There's the frog. The greatest thing. Ribbed is going to awaken again in this world, Ribbed. Our story is about to unfold. Master Alpizo forever, Ribbed. Get up.
All right. Ribbit, where am I? What am I, Ribbit? <laughs> He's just going all in on that wall, man. I know, right? The greatest thing ever will soon awaken in this world, Master El Pizza forever. Yeah, 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 whatever. Time for the fun boss, yeah. Time for the fucking idiot boss. Ow. Did he just hurt himself? This is the strat that you only come up with if you're a 999 AQ genius. It can't be. Hey, what am I doing? Go H. What would you rate this series so far? Uh, if I were not using the uh, save assist thing, then I would probably hate it. But uh, with the save assist, it's a lot of fun. Assist. Uh, yeah, yeah, sure. Call it like you see it. It's not, not off, not off base. Uh, hello, I'm not pressing up. Thank you. Uh, hello? What are you doing? Zero? Can you hear me? Zero? There's a spike there. Cool. I didn't even see it. Legit didn't even see that. I knew there were spikes down there. You're a real piece of shit for that level design. Please look out for the spikes! Thanks, Chad. I know you're only looking out for my well being. Oh, I don't have to fight the, uh, like, transformed dudes again? Uh, so do I have to fight X again? Hee hee hee, I've been waiting for you, Zero. Nothing is worse than having a show that no one comes to watch. Once I destroy the original X, I will be invincible. He's talking about streaming to Zero viewers. It's really sad. I won't let that happen. What the? <laughs> hee hee hee, thank you for coming to my show, but I'm afraid that this is real retirement of your friend. Hee hee hee, time to meet your index and release the Dark Elf. Officially dies. Yep, yep, dead. Ha 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 ga ha 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 ha. I did it. I did it at last. I terminated the legendary hero. I destroyed X at last. Boy, I really hope that we don't die a lot in this fight because this is a long fucking piece of shit cutscene.
Oh my god. Sorry to have kept you waiting, Zero. I'm going to terminate you, destroy all Neo Arcadian, and exterminate all the human beings. What do you say? A world without humans, the world only for uploads. Do you think it would be paradise? I was really expecting a little bit more. I don't know what this does, but. Oh, you are, you are jumpy. Oh, jeez, oh, jeez. Oh, just shake him off. Shake him off. You are a real piece of shit. You guys ready to watch that cutscene again? <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> cutscene, yay! <laughs> Yeah, it's because of the save assist thing. It, it basically restores your state. Yeah, exactly. I, I'm aware of why it is. combo with the popcorn eating is yap. Yap with the popcorn eating because it looks like he's chewing on it. So, our goal, don't die, just don't die. full E tank? God damn it. Or one full sub tank. Oh, what the hell? I don't even know what he's saying, but I'm sure it's rude. Okay. Why are you just licking the popcorn? 
This can't be. I'm supposed to have become invincible. I'm supposed to have obtained the power that had nearly brought the world to destruction. It was not enough, Dark Elk. Give me more strength. AKA, transform me into phase two. What is this Paper Mario looking ass boss? Damn, that filled me up a lot. Oh, I missed. You can't miss. Unless they're teleporting, I guess. It's, it's a perfectly acceptable time to miss, I guess. Wait, what? That was... Is that all? A new form has awakened! Oh, just in time! Thank you! <laughs> oh, wow! Ah, <laughs> uh, GG, I guess. Alright, GG. GG! Thank you, Zero. Thank you for stopping me. You saved me. I almost did something that can't be forgiven. Thank you so much. I was so weak-minded. I was so pathetic. Accepting your failures in life is a very difficult thing. I think I've become a, a little stronger from this lesson. Time to say goodbye, Zero. Tell Seal I'm sorry. It's time to say goodbye. Me? Me! I feel warm. Ah. The true final boss, Seal. It appears that she has saved me. She is not evil. Thank you, Zero, and goodbye. Did he just melt? Yeah, yeah, but he seems to be pretty happy about it, honestly. Zero. None here. Another boss? Do I just start the timer back up? People leave? <laughs> See you later. <laughs> Never mind. People leave. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, she wasn't always called the Dark Elf. When she was born, she had a mission to save the world and had another name. However, when her ability became a threat of world destruction, they began to call her the Dark Elf. Since someone called Dr. Weil placed a curse on her. Dr. Weil? I, I feel that I know her. You have, quick, you have to come up with a name for a new villain for a new Mega Man series. Doc, 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 Dr. Weil. Dr. Weil. I like it. Genius. Is there anything after the credits? 
Anybody know? Anything after the credits? Yes? Book! I'm trying to skip it. You can't skip it. <laughs> can't skip the credits. Unskippable credits. Can't do that. <laughs> you get to see Zero's news. We finally get to see Zero's bobs. At last. Alright, well that game was really fun. The game's really fun. I really liked it. Nick Fury. Yeah, that game was super fun. I liked it a lot. Finally, Horny Chat will be happy. Horny Chat is never happy. They are only temporarily abated. We're always just mad at you for cheating. You know. Understandable. <laughs> Two runs. Two runs of Slay the Spire. Two victories at Slay the Spire. Hey, thanks for the follow. Uh, thank you guys for all the follows. I really do appreciate that. Uh, if you like the stream, make sure you're following the stream. Uh, we stream at six nights a week. Well, six days a week. And then it bleeds into the night. <laughs> I always say that following a stream doesn't even mean that you like the stream. It's just that their content is adequate enough that you might show up again. <laughs> That's what I always say a follow is. It's not that deep. <laughs> All right. Uh, we'll wait until the credits are done, but uh, that is where we're going to call it. We got to see the scene after the credits, but if there is a scene after the credits, I couldn't just be debated. Is there a scene after the credits? Yes! I'm not going to get annoyed when I see you on a list of people online. <laughs> yep, pretty much. Pretty much. He thinks he knows. Can we just like... Can we hurry the... I swear that it let us skip the credits yesterday. Is there a marathon list of what games are left? Uh, 0, 3, 0, 4, ZX, and ZX2. Those are the only ones that are left. It's been great fun to watch. Good, I'm glad. I'm very glad. I'm not sure what the next marathon is going to be yet, but I kind of want to... Uh, have Tom Servo whip me up another another little preview before we do it. I thought that was really fun last time. You'll be kind of sad when it's over. Gungeon speedrunning marathon? No. <laughs> <coughs> okay. It seems the Dark Elf has been awakened. Hee 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 hee. The time has come for you to take action, Omega. <gasps> Finally, the Omega symbol makes sense. He, 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 he. Okay. <laughs> that was not the way that I expected that to sound. <laughs> what? Fucking machine gun he he's there. Good lord. Uh, anyway. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for enjoying the uh, Mega Man Marathon. It's been a lot of fun to uh, to play all these games. Let's go see who's online and spread the love around. Let's go with... um. Let's go with... I haven't raided Mighty Mouse in a little while. Let's raid Mighty Mouse. Mighty Mouse, uh, what's he doing? Running back and relearning Moon. Oh, Moon is a sick hack, too. If you guys don't know Mighty Mouse, go get acquainted. Super duper good dude. I think he just took back the world record for Let's Give Up yesterday, which is that uh, crazy cape hack that BK, that BK made. BK, little known fact, BK offered me $500 to play that hack, and I said no. <laughs> I will not. Fuck the cape. No way. 
Uh, go give the corn dilly raid. All right. This is a. Th I think that the corn dilly raid emote is is gonna be the new meta. Corn dilly is a sick raid emote. Uh, go give Mighty Mouse a follow if you're not following. Super good, dude. And I will catch you guys tomorrow. Peace out. Take care. Thanks so much for watching. I am out. Bye bye.